Hello, World Wide Web. I'm Dark Shadow of the Universe, now that I'm here, and welcome back to uh, Shinamu uh, 3. Uh, no, no, wait, don't go, don't go. It does that all the time when I take too long. From a yes, yes, we know, we know. Anyway, I'm gonna refresh the Twitch preview, because it's not previewing. And there it is, it tells me my bitrate is ass, but it's what Twitch's been saying lately, so. <laughs> Anyway, anyway, let us, let us go, let us begin, and let us continue. I only remember the word for that. Ah. Anyway, anyway. Okay, so last thing that happened was we spent a few hours playing face-off with Shenhua. But other than that, uh, there was a guy who needs our help, but there's a bunch of thugs that are holding him hostage. And the, the two there aren't that big of a deal. But there's one in particular who will always, always, without fail, beat our ass. And that's because he uses a cutscene to do it, and there's nothing we can do about that. So... What we gotta do, what we gotta do, is get the martial arts master in town to teach us the special move that we can use to defeat the cutscene master. But that particular martial arts master is a homeless drunk and refuses to help us if we do not procure for him an... <laughs> that's... that's what... <laughs> It's the story so far. It's the story so far at this particular point. We need to procure for the homeless, drunk martial arts master some of the most high-quality wine that he's not going to taste like the difference of at all. He's just going to chug. We know it. But the point is this wine is expensive, and we are broke. So we need money. So we need a job. This is the toughest thing yet. Let's see how it goes. Needs to teach you the quad blow. <sighs> okay. The following day. That's that's. Uh, oh, hello. Bio. Bio, wake up. She touching me again. She touching me. Mm. We're getting it's the morning. there. Is Jigolo oh, a job? Right. I, I don't think it's uh, a, a, available in this particular town. All right. Procure funds. Now, 50-year-old Lao Zhu costs 2,000 won. I need to procure funds to buy it. Procure funds. There's a black square, bottom right corner that's shown up at the bottom left. That's... This is the, the, the corner there. Oh, so that you can... Oh, wait, 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 hold on, hold on. I gotta talk to my Shenhua. Good morning, Liu. Hi. Morning. Did you get enough rest? Yeah. Yeah. Been a week since the last time I played. Damn right I got enough rest. Here we go. I need to go get a job. <laughs> I need to get a job so I can afford expensive booze. But you see now, my back behind me, I'm blocking the little mini map and the and the health bar. But over here. You can still see the little mini map in the health bar because I have placed this little little cutout right here, so you can still see that. Ha ha! I'm a smart smart. I tried to just put it to the side, but then like I had it over here, but then it, I, I had to put it behind the cat because it, you know, you don't want to block the cat with the health bar. And but then I was blocking some of the the. Uh, subtitles it would pop up, so then I tried putting it above my head, but then it was blocking other stuff when I'm going to menus, and I was like, okay, forget it. Tsk-tunk, there it is. There it is. Hey, Leo. Hmm? Yeah, fishing does get good, good money. Good luck. Be sure to come back before it gets too dark. Okay, fishing is also something that I, I can only of do course. in the mornings, so that'll, that'll work. That'll work. Hey, Shells. Hello, hello. Uh, let's see. 
Now, if I say jobs, it's probably gonna just shoot me right over to... Like, I gotta go to the village square. Go to village square. If I say jobs, it'll just go to chopping wood. Now, there's another place I can chop wood, though. And I wonder how much money I can make there. Because if I go to Talget and I work part-time at Talget, it don't pay that good. It don't pay well at all. Uh, but I still... I still need to go to the store in reality to buy some pickled garlic so that I can have... I can have the, uh... fun times of a Shenmue stream where every time I eat garlic, I eat garlic. I just think that that'd be a fun stream. I, I, I eat garlic every time I eat garlic. <sighs> I don't need to eat right now, though. I'm, I'm pretty full up from that beautiful... Wonderful breakfast that Shenhua made for us, and the dinner last night. Sounds like heartburn. Yeah, but I love I love garlic shells. I, I did you see me eat that block of cheese last night on stream? Because I finished it right before this stream. I just I just, it was a good block of cheese. I mean, it was still it wasn't it, it was supposed to be Cabo, pretty good quality brand, uh, extra sharp Vermont style white cheddar. Now, in my opinion, it was only sharp, not extra sharp. Maybe it was a little more sharp than sharp, and you might call that extra sharp, but my version of extra sharp is a bit sharper than that. And Cabot makes another called Seriously Sharp, which is even sharper than that. But their, their quality has kind of slipped in the last couple of years, and I'm like, come on, come on. And it's not that I'm just becoming desensitized to sharp cheese, thank you very much. I'm not... I am not... Just... No. Excuse me. Hello. Welcome. Sir, would you be interested in the stamp rally? What the fuck is that? Stamp what? It's an event hosted by the Bailu Fishing Association. You can fish at each of the four fishing spots to get four stamps. Which does what for get me? all the stamps and you receive a special made original jacket. I mean... Right. Well... You up for the challenge? I mean, I'm gonna do it anyway. I might as well get a free jacket, but what... Huh? Well, I still don't understand why I want this jacket. Count me in. Thanks. First, catch a white catfish in this lake. White catfish? By the way, uh, are you here to rent equipment? Yes, I'm here to rent equipment. What do you think I'm doing? I, I need... Yes. I need the quality fishing set. That's the only way to fish. This one. You got it. Don't come back empty-handed now. Empty hand I'm fishing. I fish. Or fish. While I fish. Now where would the white catfish be? That's the, that's that's the real question. Two ad breaks in six minutes? Oh god. Play games you never heard of? Oh, it, oh, uh, Shenmue 3? I, Shen, I, I feel like people heard of Shenmue 3. It was a pretty big deal that Shenmue 3 happened to I think happen I after Shenmue 1 and 2. At least if you were if you were a Sega kid like me at the end of Sega's hardware hardware life cycle. It's a quite sad time, but the Dreamcast was a fantastic system. It was just really annoying. But it wasn't until after the dream the Sega got forced out of the hardware business. Like, okay, that's it. They go in third party. They they ain't making no more hardware anymore. Dreamcast is canceled production. No one's buying it. It wasn't until after all of that happened that you had people coming out of the woodwork like, oh yeah, the Dreamcast is like we got the we got some of the best games right now. It's just too bad they're not making it anymore. It's like, well, where the hell were you five months ago? Where were you? Where were you? You bastards. <laughs> uh, but Shenmue 1 and 2 were on Dreamcast. Uh, though 2 only came out on Dreamcast in the uh, in Japan. Though the Dreamcast wasn't exactly hard to get to run Japanese discs. So. And I still had Shenmue 2 for Dreamcast. Okay, it's a catfish. Now I'll get the white paint. Hmm. 
Prefer a decker playing less popular games instead of being one in the sea of 50k people playing the same games? Well, I, I like to have a nice variety, but it is a little frustrating sometimes when I, I grab a less popular game that I'm really into and it just... The, the, the numbers on Twitch, they, they do not go up, and as, as the content creator, as the streamer, you always want number go bigger. It's, it's really nice for the lizard brain. Uh, and for the bottom line. Now, it's a, the, the key is, as much as the bigger numbers feel nice... Well, we did it! We got, got the white catfish. Boom. May as well keep going and... And make our money. Number go big, brain go happy, yeah. But if you, if you do, if you just concentrate exclusively on the numbers, like, I must please the algorithm, I must do what must be done, so that I appear higher in search results, and you don't give a damn what you're actually playing, then you find that you... I mean, you kind of miss the entire point, because it's just a job. Like... The, the whole appeal of streaming as a job is that you're doing something you like. You, you, you like it anyway. And then on top of that, it is lucrative. Now, if you stop caring if you like it or not, and you're just trying to make it lucrative, then you're just doing a, you're just doing a regular ass job with extra steps. Congratulations. Crucian car. So, there's the the balance that must be done. Like, if, if I do only the things that I personally am interested in and don't care about the uh, results on the algorithm at all, I'm not going to grow, and that's not going to be great. But if I only pursue the algorithm, I'm not going to enjoy myself, and um, I'm just... I'm just doing a job. So, that's the balance there, is like, hey, the Echo the Dolphin streams, they don't do amazing numbers, but I enjoy playing some Echo the Dolphin. So I'm gonna keep playing some Echo the Dolphin. Uh, the Shenmue streams, they do middlingly, they don't do, like, terrible, but... Uh, the Shenmue streams, they're not exactly big hits, especially outside of, like, the first two of a particular game. That's when people who are just curious about it will pop in like, huh, interesting game. But we're on part six of Shenmue 3. So anyone who was just mildly interested in Shenmue is long gone by now. But I want to see it through. I'm enjoying this, and I like hanging out with you guys and ha having some nice chats about things. Uh, but then, like, just finding more popular games, but also ones that you enjoy. That also helps. That also helps. But what's popular on Twitch and what's popular on YouTube can oftentimes be two very different things. Uh, interestingly enough, like, uh, played Lawnmower Simulator. It didn't do amazingly well on Twitch. Like, Lawnmower Simulator, not the biggest Twitch uh, Twitch game out there. But the title card on YouTube was eye-catching, and it got a uh, higher than average amount of clicks on it on YouTube, and more views from YouTube. Uh, the following day did the stream of The Angler. It was the part 10, so that was very much past its prime on YouTube. Everyone's already seen it, everyone who's just mildly interested in it has seen it moved on. YouTube doesn't show the, <laughs> the streams to many people other than the ones already subscribed to me. So I'm not getting new viewers that way. But on Twitch, the Angler is a slightly more popular thing. And we got a big raid. Got that big raid yesterday. Uh, so that also definitely helped. That's a thing that, happen that, that actually happens on Twitch. It doesn't really happen so much on YouTube. So there's the old, just the balance there. I well, like in the streams that the chat is not crowded. Sorry, if your goal is having more number. Well, I mean, as a as a uh, 
just stream a content creator, YouTuber man, uh, having more numbers means having more financial security, and I did, yes. <laughs> but I do, it, it, there is a lot to be uh, said about having a smaller community and just being able to interact with interact with people on a more like y you recognize names a lot more with a smaller community you'd be able to actually find out figure out like who people are and you you, you you're more I don't know it feels it feels good to see people drop by and you're like hey I haven't seen you in god damn that's a big fucking trap okay <laughs> um Oh, well, that's that. That's worth some cash right there. There you go. Watch what I write and give it a chance to see it on chat. Not like VTuber stars chat. Yeah, I mean, there's the uh, there's the uh, there is the always the option when one gets large enough so you can do followers only chats or or uh, like. Uh, You know, other things to slow down the chats, but that's more artificial, and even then, it's just kind of kicking the can down the road, because if you somehow manage to, on Twitch, pull in, like, 5,000 viewers, even with followers-only chat and slow chat, it's still gonna... It's still gonna be moving along quite quickly. Love watching your video, and I really well made. Been enjoying the streams from two days you've seen me, Neptune. Thank you, thank you. Uh, but yeah. Well, like, yeah, Neptune, like, I see I see your name. I recognize you from hopping in two days ago for the first time, and that's, that's, that's part of building the community, but it's the small community, which... In order to be a greatly successful, financially secure streamer, the, that's too small a community. Unless everyone is just filthy rich and decides to donate thousands of dollars, which, don't do that. that that's weird. Like, that's, that, I... If I was a booba streamer, maybe, but I'm not. And I ain't gonna be. <laughs> don't, no. <laughs> Like I said, YouTube short must be lame yesterday. Uh, yeah, they, they, that was uh, frustrating. I didn't put up a short today, but like I, I was, tr I was just trying to have a simple little short up on YouTube, and it. YouTube was like, "Hey, that that one from Forklift Load, that's not suitable for advertisers." I'm like, why, why the fuck not? Why not? But you know, as soon as it hits a short with that, it's you can't you can't fix it. I've tried telling it, okay, check to make sure it's suitable for advertisers, and it's come back said, yes, it is. But then it shows it to nobody anyway, and all the rest of the shorts get hit for you putting that public. So, yeah. <laughs> Too many fat loads for advertisers? Maybe, maybe it thought that forklift was a euphemism, and combined with load, it was definitely, definitely, hey, what are you doing here? I listened to the sound of me spinning out on the forklift like, Oh no! Ah, 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 ah. And they thought, Ah, oh, we know exactly what's going on here, you sick son of a bitch. Yeah, Get that out of there. So it had to be the little short of me just mowing grass. <laughs> uh. What do you... Rarely watched Twitch streamers has 21.3k viewers currently. Can't keep up with his chat and can't see anything you post to contribute. Ooh. Yeah, that's that's that, that's the problem, because like part of the whole thing of live streaming, a lot of the the entire appeal is the fact that you can interact. And that's that's a dinky little catfish. You're yeah, yeah, the the, 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 if, 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 if it's just a big C no! of, ah, <laughs> I'm just saying this is the way the numbers crunch. If it's just a big C of people, it's really hard to get, really hard to get a little word in edgewise. Oh. 
They had a shorter community make you remember the individual more. Put that to the test. Do you remember anything gropes me? Uh, Maxine. Dang it! You see, now I'm having... I'm having brain problems. Like, all of a sudden brain problems, Maxime. I, uh... Mm, something, something... French language, something... Uh... Souffle. Crucian Carp. <laughs> uh, yeah, we, we can hope, we can hope. I, I, I can hope that things grow and do better, but we don't, and, like, let's put it this way, even if somehow I do manage to get, like, 25,000 people watching, let's hope it's a nice, calm 25,000, and we can still have like, our, our, our little community here. I like it. It's, it, it's a, it, there's a, a thing, there's a thing, like, what was it? I'm trying to remember exactly what it's called, but it's effectively, when it comes to relationships, like friendships and what have you, as soon as you pass over a hundred individuals, it becomes very difficult to actually remember to keep track of everybody. Imagine 22,000 people doing the nerd alert. Oh, jeez. That, that'd be where I'd have to start. Well, well one thing that confuses me is uh, I know, like, Edibot, her sound alerts can overlap each other. Now, I use the Twitch sound... Uh, the, the Twitch alert box. So that's probably my problem right there. But I did shorten the duration of them so that when they do come back to back, they fire off faster. Though that only works right now in the smaller community. It's barely fast enough for that. Now, if the community was larger and more nerd alerts were coming in, it would still not be able to keep up with that. But her sound, uh, sound alerts can overlap each other. And that's I gotta I gotta figure out like how do you how, what's what's the more advanced little channel point redemption sound box thing in the jigger? It's a leak trout. It's a big old trout. Not as big as the other one. It's still big. Worth money. Like it. Probably uses blurp. Okay, okay, blurp. I could check out the blurp blurp, but I do like having the gift to go with it, but, I mean, that's not necessary. Not absolutely, but... <laughs> I honestly didn't think it'd say anything. It said French, that's good. <laughs> that's good enough? Okay. <laughs> so, you got the French part right, there we are. Attempted murder! <laughs> Wants to want to know what I use for the nerd alerts? I I use the uh, I just use the Twitch alert box. They have it like. I'll pass. Uh, 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 it's a carp. It, it, okay. Go back to Huang's tackle. Hey Huang, got your tackle right here. It's the catfish, the white catfish, the Crucian carp. The Crucian carp. The, okay. What was okay? That yeah. That trout. 5.4 kilo. Man, that's a... The trout was like 13, 14 pounds? Woo! Money. Oh, yeah. Later. Uncanny. What a catch. Thanks. I got I your white catfish, too. Can I have my stamp? I want my stamp. You promised me a stamp. I caught your damn... I caught several. Why is this? What? Sir! Sir! Where's my stamp? Yes, I have time to chop wood, that's good, but where's my stamp? He said I'd get a stamp for catching a white catfish. Is, is this like, ah, oh yeah, it was for three minutes in the ring, and you pinned him in two. <laughs> A 
Hey, Huang. You're my stamp. Well, shit. <laughs> I caught one. Way to go. Here's your stamp. Thanks. Next is the mountain stream behind Joy Park. Oh, okay. You should be able to catch a blue catfish there. What are we catching? Blue like catfish. Pokemon? Should I get you some different equipment? Can I still rent a... I can keep fishing. This one. You got it. Nice. They'll come back empty-handed now. Okay. Let's head on there quickly. As it's coming eh, to, down enough. to the afternoon. Do, 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 do. Gotta go behind Joy Park. Go behind Joy Park. Get to the mountainous river. Yeah. Forklift man catching fish again. He's forklift man. Yeah. <laughs> the way he tilts when he runs uphill. Hey, Joy Park? Joy Park, okay, boom. Got it. I think I can fish here. What is the next review? Still Killjoy 3, still working on finishing I got more to script done today. I've been busy with a lot of things, though, which is just... Ugh. Like, there's a lot of projects that I've had kind of sitting on the back burner because I was like, I'm going to... I'm gonna make it big on YouTube, and then that'll help pay for being able to do these things. Uh, and then, you know, this year comes around and YouTube ain't fucking doing good at all. And so it's like, well, that's not gonna happen. So in the back of my mind, I'm thinking like, well, if I can do these things, maybe I could actually make some money off of that, hopefully. Um, so that's... I'm still trying to get the YouTube stuff done, but, like, inspiration is always the best fuel, and it's really hard when YouTube's there, like, okay, okay, good trout, good trout. Forklift man made redundant by eagle, oh no. <laughs> oh no, forklift man going to kill himself now. But, uh, how money did I get just from fishing? Uh, what was that, like 300 something dollars there? Minus the 50 for the rental, so like 250, 280-ish, I don't know. Compared to the fact that, you know, chopping wood for like 30 in-game minutes makes me like, what was it, 40 bucks? Another trout. I need a blue catfish. Where the hell? I mean, it's just it's just RNG. Uh, let me try casting around that stem. See if that has any difference in them. Actually, this would probably be worse for catching a catfish. This is here by the. You know, they're, they're bottom feeders. They ain't gonna have nothing to eat over here. How do you use a Twitch sound box? Like, how do you make it so people can on the stream can use it? Uh, well, that is uh, on uh, th through Twitch. They have their own like alert box menu. And, like, like, give me just a minute. Give me just a minute. <laughs> yeah, how the how the nerd works. How the nerd works. We'll, we'll explain the inner workings of. Oh, we got a catfish there, actually. Not a blue one. I mean, it's clearly blue, but it's not a blue catfish, blue catfish. But uh, hold on. I'll pass. No, 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 you won't. No, you won't. No, you won't. You son, I can't, like, press and start quits the fucking... Fuck! Oh, I was just trying to pause the game. Okay, I made a little money. Just very little. But I made, like, 20... I see you've caught one. I told you my gear is top. Yeah, of I caught head. one. Thank you.
Oh, that's right. Start doesn't do that. I press the right bumper. Okay. Anyway, um... Let me, uh... Let me show y'all what I'm talking about here. Now, do... Got the, uh... Oh, sorry, Tara. You got the alerts menu right over here. And so there, you got the create alert box, where I got the alert box over there. You edit your alerts. And then you got your channel points ones right here. I got set up over here, like, don't hack off your limbs. Got to set it. Alert condition is don't hack off your limbs. You got to set that manually, because you got to... Let's see. Don't hack <laughs> off your limbs. You got what you have to do along with that is in viewer rewards down here have the channel point rewards and manage rewards and challenges custom rewards I had to create don't hack off your limbs as a reward and then in the alert box let's see in the alert box in the general settings is don't hack off your limbs it defaults to any channel point redemption, but it lists all of the channel point redemptions you could have. So we specifically say that Don't Hack Off Your Limbs will create Don't Hack Off Your Limbs. The variant name is Don't Hack Off Your Limbs. We set the, I set the duration to four seconds to hopefully allow it to happen somewhat close to each other. The default is ten seconds. You get the visuals and sound. Got the image library, upload the file, got the specific GIF lim linked to that particular thing, the sound linked to that particular thing. And you just gotta set it all up like that. And boom, there you go. People can redeem, don't hack off your limbs, or nuts. No, yeah, no, we're not, not saving any changes. You got nutsos and the buttsos. What are you looking at? They fucking leave. Got pure evil right there. Well, shit. <laughs> that make this better or worse. And just saying those two things aren't necessarily mutually exclusive. You know, all that fun stuff. All that fun stuff right in there. Okay. Can I continue fishing? No, I gotta rent the dang thing again. Crap. Okay, let's run back and rent it again. Getting to be late in the afternoon. Uh, I'm spending mo You gotta spend money to make money. But, eesh. But what's this? Ah, thank you, thank you, Cricket Gaming. Thank you very much. Oh boy, oh boy. I need... I need another one. Excuse me. Hello. Welcome. How's the fishing going? You caught a big one? No. You, you took my money and took my pole. No. Not yet. This spot is in the stream behind Joy Park. You didn't go to the wrong place, did you? I went to the right place, but I pressed oh, the start I button. Forget, blue catfish like places with a strong current. Oh. Why don't you aim for a spot like that? Okay. Got it. Hey, thanks for your help. That's interesting. Should I get you some different equipment? Okay, okay. Let's see. Let's see. Ooh, quality fishing set rent. Yes. This one. You got it. Don't come back empty-handed now. Okay, back to fishing. If I come back empty-handed, then I just gave him fifty bucks and I got nothing for it. Though, to be fair, these are, are, uh, this, these are Yuan, not, uh, not necessarily the same. Value is something along the lines of five Yuan is one dollar, so I'm giving him ten dollars. And it's not two thousand dollars that the booze costs. It's 2001. It's $400. <laughs> I think I can fish here. Oh, you think, do you?
Okay, so yeah, this is... This is where I'm supposed to catch... Catfish-like place with strong current. That makes no damn sense, but okay. Catfish love places where they can't freaking get their food. They just, they just really enjoy it. It's fun. It's fun. Whoa! Thank you, thank you, thank you very much. For the anonymous tip. Hey, the, the, the little... The, uh... Stream Elements alert box is actually working. <laughs> A lot of times it doesn't. <laughs> Oh. Oh, 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 oh. There we go. Okay, nice sized trout, nice sized trout. Almost nice enough that I would actually make back my money if I press start right now, which I'm not going to do. But I hate how it resets my aim. Is it still moving to the left there? Could I actually point it closer to the center of the... ...of the waterfall? Some catfish like strong currents, some like slow. Depends on what kind. Learn that in river monsters. Oh. Like, is that more sim or not? I mean, I, I, I can't tell. I still miss... The fishing in the Final Fantasy 15 VR fishing game for PSVR. Did that way back in the day. The fishing wasn't too bad, but it wouldn't let you stick to the fishing for too long. It was just there like, and this is probably getting boring, so boom, a boss appears and you gotta do a really shitty crossbow fight. Favorite game of all time? Well, that would have to... Okay, so no, it wasn't moving, it just gets... It's just Ryo's aim. It's, it's like he's playing darts, it's just going all over the place, okay. But I'm, I'm, I'm always... Always for Earth Defense Force. That's my favorite game series right there. Though I don't play it as often on stream because... If I'm just playing an older Earth Defense Force by myself, it's very difficult to pay attention to chats. And, uh... Not so many people are interested in it, so it's, that's one of those things where... I... I love the game, but... God damn, that carp sucked! Um, I love the game, but... It's... Difficult to... Stream, and actually work on improving my numbers as a streamer. Now, if I was already a streamer that was pulling in, like, 10,000 viewers a stream, then maybe I could just pop on Earth Defense Force and be like, HA! <laughs> but even then, I'd be like, oh, this stream only got, like, 3,000 viewers. Man. Then again. Then again. When you get to streams that size, would a stream on a, of a game that means you have a difficult time paying attention to chat results in a lower lower number of viewers because you can't pay attention to chat with that many people anyway. Like, you, you can kind of glance and sort of try and catch things. Like, I can read fast, but not as fast as some chats. It's like, damn. When am I going to stream Final Fantasy XIV again? Ah, I don't know. I don't know. There's been a lot of things I've wanted to get to. Uh, Final Fantasy XIV, I just haven't quite been in the mood for running around and grinding in an MMO. I don't know. we go. What the hell is with that thing? It has no eyes. It's like a... I caught a Swedish fish. What the fuck is that? What is that? There's a cool pinball machine called Galactic Tank Force that's similar in theme. 
I like garlic, but do I like onions? Oh, I love me some onions. I got some onions. I could eat. Uh, I could eat an onion right here. Uh, I just, you know, it's kind of hard to get the smell off my hands afterwards. You know. He's got a decent sized catfish. Oh, man, this guy's letting me fish late into the afternoon today. I'm liking this. I'm like, yeah, fishing. Awesome. But like, hey, Shanwa, you know that guy in the who's in danger and he, he's worried for his life? Still in danger, but guess what? Caught lots of amazing fish today. Look at all these stamps. I'm like a Pokemon master catching gym badges. This is great. And she's gonna be like, Rio, I am really concerned about this. And I'm like, it's fine, I'm still gonna kill the man who killed my father. And she's gonna be there like, like, no. And um, she, we're gonna have a, like a hard time together, but then she's gonna feel all better when we play some face off. Poor Charlie, when my hands smell like onions. <laughs> uh, you despise onions? They're your antichrist? I. I like food. I like to eat. I like to not starve to death. That's hey, that's what are you <laughs> That's been my whole thing. <laughs> Though I do understand that, especially in this country, it is a bit of a unique perspective to be someone who knows what it's like to suffer from extreme malnourishment and near starvation. But it sticks with you. I'm just saying, like. <laughs> A lot of people are really picky about what they eat, and I just cannot wrap my head around it. I'm like, hey, uh, are you dead today? No? Cool! It did its job. <laughs> like onions, but not by itself? I, I like... I, it's... The, the problem... One problem with the fact that I, uh grew up with extreme malnourishment and near starvation is a lot of times the idea that foods go with other foods is also difficult for me to grasp. Like, people were saying, what are you doing eating that cheese? And I'm eating it like a uh, chocolate bar. It's like, yeah, I like cheese. What I mean by that is, here's cheese I eat. Uh, I'll have potato chips. I like original flavor plain potato chips without dip. I just like potato chips. Um, I have that loaf of Italian bread. Yeah, I'll just have the bread. <laughs> uh, and, I, like, Charlie looking, what the holy heck can Nate? That is a big old trout. There's some money right there. But, uh, yeah, like, Charlie will look at me and she'll be like, bread is an ingredient. And I'm like, it's fine. I'm not. I'm not put, taking spoonfuls of baking soda or something. I already learned my lesson on that one. <laughs> you didn't choose to be a picky eater. Really annoys you. Love to love onion and mushroom and so many other things. Hate being picky. Well, that's fair. Uh, like I, like I said, my my perspective comes from extreme malnourishment and near starvation. It's not a situation I would wish on anybody. So it's it's just. Vastly different perspectives. You know, the divorce of your father when you were two years old. Father kept all the house and the materials. Mother quit. Your father, he in his arms with nothing. Oof. Dang. People with strong Denisovian traits may be more prone to, like, bland and plain food. Denisovian. See, that's the problem, is I'm, I, I'm drawing a blank on particularly what that means. Oh, I also like spices and all that stuff. I... I'm there at Ace Har Hardware buying my bottle of asshole prolapser, like Ellen. Oh, an older 
older human species, or like how there were Neanderthals as well. Okay, so an another humanoid hominid kind of, so a Denisovian, Neanderthal, Cro-Magnum, all that fun stuff. Hello, young Cassie. Hello, hello. They were doing the Angler Shenmue edition. <laughs> Present something to your class on Thursday and not ready, ready to, to don't know what to do. Or what what particular thing do you need to present? Mushrooms for years because the texture reminded you too much of rotten meat. Now, with the rotten meat, I feel it's more of a smell thing. I don't know. Uh, young Kazi, I, I, I lived in the forest in Vermont, and I was three years old. <laughs> that's a big old carp. That's, 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 that's like the biggest carp I've seen. Funny story about hating onion. Mother really wanted you to eat some, so she hid it in your hamburger. First bite, you knew something was wrong. Your mother could not believe you sensed the onion. I, I love onion on my hamburger, specifically because I can taste it. Of course you, t you t sense the onion. Onion's a very strong flavor. Beautiful trout. Nice, nice, nice. Do I prefer onions cooked or raw? Well, I prefer them cooked, but I'll... Like, on a burger, I'll have a slice... J just a slice of raw onion. Uh... But also, and like, cooked onions are fine on burgers as well, but, like, with a... With a cheesesteak, I always prefer the onion to be cooked simply because it's a texture thing with a cheesesteak. And a flavor thing, like caramelizing an onion is tasty, and it, works, it matches very well with what a cheesesteak's supposed to be. But like on a... Just having a sandwich, if I have the stuff to make sandwiches, I'll just have a... Uh, like I'll have some lettuce, a slice of onion, slice of tomato, a little bit of of a uh, like ham or turkey, and then some mustard on there, and a slice of cheese, and it's like, mm, mm. especially if you can get some real cheese, not that processed shit. Like it'll work with processed shit, but if you've had a sandwich with made with real cheese, like if you you know the difference between cheese and processed cheese. Like, there's, there's, there's a gulf of difference between these. Things. Yellow or brown mustard? I always just have yellow, so I don't really have brown mustard to try, so I've never tried actually making a sandwich with brown mustard. Stupidest argument you ever heard was you can't even taste the onion. Your answer was, then why do you put them in if you can't taste them? <laughs> That's a very good response, and also... What the hell are they talking about? But if that's why they eat it, because they can't taste it, I mean, they're really not making a great argument 
for someone who can. <laughs> I'll pass. Oh, just finish your cast, you son of a... Okay. We're fine. We're fine. All right, all right. Boom, boom. Big-ass trout. Big-ass catfish. Huge trout. Mm. Very nice. Very nice. I love this. Okay. 406 buccarinos. Made 305 that time. We made a lot of money today. Just look at this haul. You've got quite some skill. You're goddamn right I do. I just got lucky. Well, you don't have to tell him about boning the fish. You... Oh, damn it. We gotta go back to him so we can get our stamp. <sighs> Deli mustard, a little more spicy? Hmm, hmm. I remember one so dark. one uh, type of like Maybe I should head back to novelty house. mustard. Back when I was younger, uh, they made this mustard that was uh, like chili flavored, and I fucking loved that shit. I just have a hot dog slathered in chili mustard. It was so fucking good. <laughs> uh, hello, ADR. Hello, hello. I gotta run over. Run over and get my stamp, unless he's freaking left his spot because it, 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 his, his job is over. Like he, he ain't doing no rentals out no more. Is he there? Is he there? He's there. I see him. Unless he put a statue up. No, it's him. I caught one. Way to go. Here's your stamp. Nice. Thanks. Now the next spot is the pond beyond Sunflower Grove. There should be green catfish there. No. Oh. Green catfish. Sorry, bud. Rentals are done for the day. You've got to come earlier if you want to fish. Green catfish. We just got, got to get all the whole whole set. Like, what, what, what's the last kind of catfish color going to be? Ah. <sighs> Welcome back. Thanks. Everything okay, Dio? I got a lot of mm. fish. Yeah. Why do you ask? I realize this must be a big change of pace for you. This fishing? So I'm doing a lot. So I wanted to make sure you're holding up okay. <laughs> the stress of fishing. Bruises, I'm fine. What the hell are you doing with the fish, okay. Rio? Just checking. I appreciate it, but you don't need to worry. I'm worried All now. Right. Will you cut some bruises? What, what the hell are you talking about, Rio? Xinhua. Hey, Xinhua. Hmm? Do you want to keep talking? <laughs> do you never shut up, Ryo? Are you having any trouble, Xinhua? What do you mean? With me talking to you constantly. Is there anything I can help with? Besides looking for your father? Oh, um... You've done so much for me. I want to return the favor. Thanks. I appreciate that. Just tell me if there's anything I can do. We finally Not take the out moment. the trash trio. But I'll be sure to tell you if something comes up. Okay, great. All right, we got dishes duty later. Rio, is there something on your mind? Never. <laughs> Sometimes you look deep in thought. It's a, just an illusion. Oh, yeah. Sorry. It's just so much has happened, and. Yet we know so little. Ryo always knows little. Yes, Shenhua. We have still got a lot to do, too. So, at times like this, it helps to get outside your own head. Yeah. Your father, my father, the mirrors. Ryo, you know, you don't have to solve all of these problems yourself. Well, he ain't gonna solve a single one I of them. I know. Good, Rio. Just 
Please remember that you are not alone. He has a hard time keeping track of things. Thanks, Shenhua. <laughs> okay, we just put that down, walked over there to the, the, the table, had our little conversation, and we just kind of teleported right back over here, and she's going to continue knitting. I don't know what she knitting, but she's been working on the thing for a while. It's going to be the longest scarf ever. Hey, Shenhua. Hmm? Do you want to keep talking? With my mouth part. The Shinmu tree's blossoms are beautiful. Indeed. They're in full bloom, though. So the petals will start dropping soon. That's a shame. There's a flower for every season, though. True enough. And in winter, the really tall mountains get a beautiful dusting of snow. So you do get snow here? Mm-hmm. And little flowers manage to blossom through it. That's why I never get down, no matter the season. Oh, he's a Listen, ray of sunshine yeah. there, Shen. I want to hear more about you. Yeah? What's up? What season do you like? <sighs> Me? I like... Let's see. Spring, summer, winter, autumn. Hmm. Now... I always kind of enjoyed autumn. You got... You got a lot of great times in autumn. You got your... You got your... Halloweenses. You got your Thanksgivingators. It's it's like nice temperature, but it the the ocean's still warm. Like it's nice. Winter kind of sucks ass. Like it starts off strong. You hit December twenty first, it's winter. You hit December twenty fifth, it's Christmas, and then you got three months of shit. Oh, the dub is so bad for your ears, but it's nothing compared to Shenmue 1 and 2 that was more awful compared to 3. I mean, it's the same actor for Ryo in 1 and 2, so he was less experienced then. And that was on Dreamcast. Those discs only had one gigabyte of size, and it had a, so much dialogue. They did a lot of compression, so it sounded off. Autumn temps and hoodie weather, beautiful Ohio trees, and the sound of the leaves when you shuffle your feet. Eh, eh, I'm, I kind of love autumn. I really do. Though I do like summer, but autumn, like... Like, summer in Texas can get oppressively hot, and the, the hurricanes come and knock out your power, and then you gotta deal with that. And... Like, autumn still has a nice heat to it in Texas, and you got all... Like I said, you got your Halloweens, and you got your... You got your Thanksgiving, and Thanksgiving is, like, my go-to. Also, I've been sitting here staring at Shenwa for, like, five minutes straight thinking about this. And summer's my birthday, too, but... It's... I don't know. Summer, besides my birthday in there, I can't think of anything that's really, like, yay gung-ho about summer. Of course, I never leave the house. I don't... I don't have... A history of going out with friends to the beach. Like, what friends? What beach? Uh, so... <laughs> uh, it's a tough one there. And spring just has a lot of shitty weather. Like, it, it, it's... It's been... It's been rough. It has to be autumn. Yes, autumn has the best food. Yeah, that, yeah. So, it's the same in Bailu, huh? Pure Everything's evil. been harvested fresh. And the fish are plump, too. I'm getting hungry just thinking about it. Let's be eat I the think fish. you love it here in the fall. Maybe so. What's autumn like in Yokosuka? Well, there's the... Uh, culture festival, the autumn festival, or field day. I don't know what any of these are. <laughs> uh, I, uh, it's the autumn festival. Yokosuka has an autumn festival. Oh? What are Japanese festivals like? We carry omikoshi on our shoulders. What is that? It's built like a small house, and we believe there's a god living inside. So the house is the omikoshi? Right. And everyone comes together to carry it. So you carry a god's house? Yeah. And we parade through the town, shouting and laughing. That actually sounds like fun. Ryo, this explains a lot. You're out of your damn mind. 
Hey, Xinhua. Hmm? Do you want to keep talking? Hello, Foxcaru. Twitch isn't sending out the YouTube notifications. And YouTube's been sending... Uh, Twitch isn't sending out the stream. Do you have a favorite oh. place in Bailu? Okay. The vantage point. I like to look out over the village in the morning. Oh, yeah. Uh, she's Chinese, he's Japanese. Oh, uh, yeah. That sounds nice. But I like the Verdant Bridge, too. You do? Mm-hmm. I used to play around there all the time as a kid. That's great. And my father used to say... Shenhua, get your ass back! What? He was giving me a clue. About the bridge? He said that the bridge and our house shared a special connection. There's secret underground passage somewhere in here? He did? I didn't understand at the time. I was just a kid. I knew it. It must be related to the dragon and phoenix patterns in that photo. Now, he also You're specifically right. said that's not we the case. We have to find out more. Absolutely. Listen, Leo. I want to hear more about you. Anything about your hometown yeah. have a connection? Have you come to like any particular spots in the village? Let me think. Uh, Rainbow Basin, Sunset Hill, Shenhua's house, Sunflower Grove. Hmm. Well, Shenhua. You know what a place I like the most is a spot right under your ass right now. I quite like it here, actually. Here? Yeah. Here at your house. Oh, I see. I know it's not exactly polite of me to say this, but... Show me that point. Whenever I come <laughs> back here, I feel like I'm coming home. I'm happy to hear that. This yeah. sounds like, like she's scared to hear that. I want you to feel at home here. <laughs> hey, Xinhua. I still have some cleaning up to do. You should get some rest. No, no, yeah. no, Shanhua. I might do that. You know the deal now. You know the deal by now. When we get to this part is when it's time to say, hey. Leo. What's up? There's a game that's taking Bailu by storm right now. Want to play? What kind of game? It's called Face Off. What kind of name is that? Hey, just say fuck it and leave. Now we're playing. We're playing. Okay, I'll play. <laughs> And yeah, Terra is off. right here. Ready. Set. Uh. Rock. Paper. God damn it. <laughs> I win. That was a hideous face, by the way. You would say that. What? Ouch. That's all you say so, every single time. Again? Face off. Ready. Set. Paper. Paper. Still don't know how she manages the P sounds with a mouth set like that. Hey, pair. Hey, pair. What the? Hey, hey, hey. Hi, Leo. Shenhua. <laughs> we made the same face. So we did. Okay, here goes. Face off. Ready. Set. Paper. Scissors. God damn it. I win. That was a hideous face, by the way. What? Ouch! It's getting late. We should stop for today. Oh, we always... Wow. Yeah, it is late. We can play again tomorrow. For sure. You just, you just go up to her and be like... She's gonna have nightmares about my face. It's gonna be great. <laughs> <sighs> Still gotta get to the point where she likes us enough to tuck us in at night. I don't know if that happens, but I, I, I wanted to. Leo. Leo, wake up. <clears throat> it's the morning. Oh, right. Cure funds. We need money. I need that money. I missed the part where that's my problem. Good morning, Leo. Morning. morning. Did you get enough rest? 
Yeah. yeah. All right. But the creative Godzilla minus one to make a great Shenmue movie. It's great to portray the characters of Godzilla. I'm just imagining, like, you know, stomping the fuck around Bailu Village. Double-blowing the temple and just, you know... Hey, Ryo. Mm -hmm. Slap my Good ass. <laughs> Be sure to come back before I just wanted to run out there and slap Ryo's ass. I understand. Get, him, get, him, get his day started right. to get my next stamp of fishy fishness. No, no, wrong button, wrong button. Okay, so we have $1,500. Not bad, not bad. Almost got enough to buy that booze. I'm just gonna keep fishing. Let me get that stamp. <laughs> Slap his jeans that he hasn't washed in three games. <laughs> Alright, depending on how you look at it, it's either been a few months, according to the timeline between Shenmue 1, 2, and 3, or it's been about 20 years, according to how long it's actually been. So, yeah. Be more like joy to slap Ryo's ass each morning, and Ryo to just be like, "Ow, why did you do that?" And she'd say something like, "Really coming on to him, like yes, yeah, I want to do that, and that's mm hmm, want to get started right, Ryo." And he's gonna be there like, "You could start by not slapping me on the butt. That hurts." And <laughs> she just get frustrated with his stupid ass. Excuse me. Hello, welcome. How's the fishing going? You caught a big one? I just woke up. No, not yet. This spot is the pond just past Sunflower Grove. You got it right, didn't you? Oh, and remember, green catfish hang out in dark places, like in the shade of rocks. Why don't you aim for a spot like that? Got it. Thanks for your help. Should I get you some different equipment? You could get me the same expensive ass equipment you've been getting me this whole time. This one. You got it. Don't come back empty handed now. Did you find a clue about my father? Uh, yeah. Uh, I did. At the fishing pond. <laughs> Erio Trina. Trying to explain why he's been spending all his time fishing when he's supposed to be searching for the missing father of the lady he there like. By the way, I really like hanging out at your house and sneaking up behind you while you cook to smell your hair. And Shanghua there like, uh, Rio? But what's this? Well, I'm sorry, baby, but it's true. It's just how I feel. And how I'm going to feel you. Come on. Come to my bedroom again, Chenoa. I'll show you the double blow. And then... Then her father walks in the door like, Are you winning, Shenhua? And she's like, Oh, thank God, Dad's here. Uh, Ryo, you can leave now. <laughs> and then you get surprised when your Japanese lessons sound like out of a 90s porno. Oh god, what was that? There was one... There was one thing that they taught me recently in kanji study, and they're like, by the way, this is also slang for a blowjob. And I'm like, it's what now? Yeah, it's slang for a blowjob, just so you know, like... You, you, you can keep that in mind. I think I can fish here. In the shade of rocks. 
Yeah. Now I'm just going to wait here. Okay, there we go. Oh, boom! That is the wrong catfish. But it's a catfish. You just gotta get one of the shiny catfish. Gotta get a green catfish. Nice, delicious green catfish. Got catfished by a catfish. I remember when I was younger, living at my grandmother's, uh, my uncle, he caught a cat. He went fishing. He caught catfish. He brought home a catfish, and it was they were going to, you know, cook it and prepare it and all that. Like, yeah. Came home with a haul. We're going we're gonna to have this catfish. And he had never, like, prepared one before. But he got all the all the little guides, all the little things, all the little videos, like, here's what you do. Here's how to do that. Here's how to do this. And so there was the technique for how to... how to remove the head with all of the organs and what have you. And, and it'd be... We're just gonna... Get off that, and you can prepare the meat and all that, and it'll be ready to throw on the grill. And here you go. Um, but uh, the problem was the fish didn't die, and it was just kind of a head with its guts, and it was just like for like twenty minutes, and then they were like, "This is fucked up," and they just threw it in bo boiling water to kill it. Eh, good enough. Oh, it did the job, it did the job. Oh yes, I know what catfishing is. Ha bum bum bum. That's a big old catfish. Wrong one, but a big old one. Still need a green one. This is the pond past Sunflower Grove. I know how to prepare a fish alive. I've seen... I've seen that there are techniques and videos of like, oh, here's a fish that's been cooked, and by the way, it's still alive, and it's it's uh, presented that way. And it's like, Jesus Christ, this is just torture, this is just abuse, don't fucking do that. Why the hell would you want to have the animal you're eating that is cooked be alive? Yeah, it's like... Ugh. Like, the videos of people at the restaurant being like, ah, and just pulling off, like, cooked pe bits off its side, like, yum, yum, yum. And it's there, like, <laughs> like, what the fuck is wrong with you? Don't do that. Ooh. Now that should be a poor soy sauce on a dead squid. Well, that the way that works is it looks weird, uh, but the squid is dead. It doesn't feel a thing. It's moving because of the way the it's the, the way muscles move is because of like sodium contracting with it, it, it's a specific thing that 
it, it's, it's just kind of a chemical reaction. The, the salt in the soy sauce creates, uh, it causes the muscles to kind of spasm a bit. But the squid is dead. It, it is very dead at that point. green son of a bitch. This is the pond he's talking about, right? Because it seems to be that there ain't no damn green catfish here. I'm casting into the shade of this fucking rock and there's just... Mm. I was told I could look at the eclipse through a calendar. I tried, but it strained my eyes. Lobster are lobster are crustaceans, and like all crustaceans, they have to be like well, I guess they don't have to be cooked alive. But lobster, like shrimp, you can sort of clean and then quickly freeze uh, because they're small enough. But lobster, you can't really quickly freeze them. And uh, yeah, crab, similar kind of thing. So, yeah, oh god, there was a video of, like, crabs being sold in a, live crabs being sold packaged in a Japanese fish market. Uh, they were probably just chilled significantly to slow their metabolism and just kind of put them in a bit of a stupor, but they were still alive, and they were being sold as alive, but... Some of them started to thaw out. Some of them started to warm up and feel a bit better. And were tearing their way through the packaging to get out. Found the cause for the zombie apocalypse. Vengeful sentient salt. Big ol' that is a big ol' Oof. That was a huge friggin' fish. That's worth some monies. About to angle yourself, didn't check out the 60 for 60, did you? I don't think, I don't recall 60 for 60, so I, I, if I was told to do that and I forgot, or like, I don't even know what it is. <laughs> We're getting a lot of big fish here today. This is some great, great catches. Nice, nice. Got some monies. This is going to be the third stamp of four. So there's going to be one more stamp I got to get. Okay. Oh, God. Oh, yeah, the Ric Flair. The, 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 the 
there was a, one thing, like, I didn't get to finish reading the uh, ingredients on the Ric Flair Woo! energy drink, and the, the next thing listed was cordyceps. <laughs> and I'm like, wait just a ding-dang old minute here. I might not be the sharpest knife in the crayon box. Size carp, honestly. Getting some good sized fish from this pond. Think of how much garlic that'll be? Forklift Man has been replaced by Forklift the Forklift AI. He's now searching for a new title. Fishing Man is in testing. <laughs> Get your fishy ass over here. Emma. I only got one. I only got one of the dang green catfish. I mean, that's all I need, but. Hey, the, the, the special fish is getting a little rarer. Yeah, no. How did you miss the green catfish? I, 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 I don't know. It was, it was freaking big. I was there like, my god, the size of this thing. It was something like 6,000. They don't look too special if you compare them to the legendary fish in Red Dead Redemption 2. Well, yeah, but... I never got that far in Red Dead Redemption 2. Get all the fish away. I'm sorry. Oh. Come on, you little beast. It's just a regular ass catfish. It is evil. I don't like it. Throw it back. I'll pass. Okay, we'll keep the damn thing then. All right, but yeah, let's see. Catfish, 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 green catfish, 6,352 grams. Woo! Nice. I was fishing for the green catfish there. As a specific one I was trying to go for, 534. God damn! We're rich! Just look at this haul. You've got quite some skill. I just got lucky. Okay, now I need the last the last of the fish. How much how much money do I have? I technically have enough money right now, but I want the fish. 
the guy can the guy being tortured in pain can wait. I need the last fish. And the guy can tell me the hint as to where the hell to get the last fish. I caught one. Way to go! Here's your stamp. Yeah. Thanks. Last and final location. Go downstream of the Verdant Bridge. Downstream. If you catch the legendary red catfish, your rally is complete. Red, red catfish. catfish. Should I get you some different equipment? Do you have a stronger one? This one. You got it. They'll come back empty-handed now. Now, this, this legendary red catfish, does it happen to have a specific legendary favorite spot? Excuse me. Hello. Welcome. How's the fishing going? You caught a big one? No. Not yet. The spot is downstream of Verdant Bridge. You didn't mess that up, did you? Oh. And I heard someone saw red catfish while coming out of a cave. If you're looking to catch one, why don't you go there? Got it. Thanks for your help. Hey. Right. Red catfish find it by the cave. All right. No problem. No problem. Here we go. Here we go. We catch ourselves a red catfish. We're going to be the best fishermen in all of Bailu Village. Shenhua's going to be so proud of us. Uh, then we'll remember to do something about finding her father. And avenging mine. Possibly avenging her father, too, depending on how late we are. Excuse me, pardon me, excuse me! Where's the fishing spot? Is it on this side or that side? Ah, yes, this side, this side. I think I can fish here. I think I can fish here. All right. Coming out of a cave. I don't see a single damn cave. I mean, I'm. I did just come out of a. Thing. What the hell is I gotta? Do? Okay. There is a fishing spot across the way. And I gotta aim for the spot I'm standing at, because I just came out of cave. Uh -huh. Bite the fucking knock! Thank you. Fishing spot on the other side. Just guess I'll just keep fishing right here and hoping for the best. For if man cast his rod and by Lou catch the fish of the legends of old. 
No, that was me wrapping my uh, with my fingers. It's just, but she's purring right here. She gotta put these out. Ain't hey there, girl? Is that too far? Cause fish did appear a little closer. Actually, see a red fish and cast towards it. That'd be a nice thing. Regular catfish. Now let's just try straight away. See, what does this bring us? Okay, there are fish showing up, so that's a good sign. And just doing a choreographed kind of interpretive dance. I must catch the legendary red catfish. Oh yeah, Rio, Rio got that drone view of his of his lure. Does make it a little bit more interesting. Be like, oh, oh, is he gonna get it? Is he gonna no? Then unless they're going straight for the for the bait, they are not going. They're gonna bite it. They just hmm. swimming around, swimming around. There it is. not a red catfish. You're not red or a catfish. Okay, Tara. You don't have to be a red catfish. You're a black cat. Everyone loves that. My Tara loves fish. Dobby does not, interestingly enough. He does not care for fish. He doesn't like shrimp. He likes bread. Like, I have to get my loaves of bread put away. Because if I leave it on the counter, he will jump up there and tear open the bag and eat the bread. Which is kind of annoying. When you want the bread to not be ruined. And yet you're, you're short on funds and you're just trying to keep yourself fed. You know? They say don't cry over spilled milk, but imagine this is the only milk you have for like two months. Or 
Red ones appear more um, along the rocks just to the right. I was trying that, but when I started just right there, it, it seemed to be nothing was appearing. So, I'm gonna pull it a little until the fish appear, then I can stop and wait. It just came out of the rock. He's, oh, wait, 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 fish, wait, no! Oh, he just went through the rock. We got ghost fish. Had like French fries, but a favorite was raw egg and milk mixed together. Hmm. We got the legendary red catfish, the dinky one, but we got it. Hell yes. If, if we can get a bigger red catfish. As long as we're here and we're fishing. May as well get it all. Okay, I only had to pull it a little bit before the fish showed up. Okay, okay. Wait the fucking hook! Go there, we have it. There is delicious, delicious, fishes, fishes. Yes, -ums. that is a dinky little bastard. What's that worth? Like five bucks? Maxim is also me playing Armored Core 6. I was wondering about, like, there, there's been times I'm thinking, like, hey, maybe I could jump into Armored Core 6 and see about doing a, trying to do some swords, like a sword-focused kind of thing. Like, I've seen people try the sword-only challenge stuff. I was thinking about that, but I'm not much of a challenge run player. I'm just trying to have fun. But, like, I almost inadvertently kind of did a shotgun-only challenge run just because... I really like the shotguns in Armored Core, so I just stuck with them. And when I had the quad shotgun set, man was it good. I got, I got comments telling me you really should, really should change up your gear and mix it up. It's, it's, it's not good to just use the same thing over and over again, and I'm thinking like, yeah, but I kicked the last boss's ass first try easy. Like, I just... Quad shotguns, real nice. <laughs> There's so much commercial on Twitch. Uh, Twitch tends to have its ad breaks, which can be annoying. They come up and it's like, sometimes it's like a minute and a half or longer. But uh, I don't know on YouTube. Um, it, it, I, it, it's set to supposed to, it's supposed to like 
I set it to conservatively, like put put on a few ads, but I still have to go in after the facts when it's time to for it to figure out where the ad breaks are on the VOD and tell it stop putting 50 ads in the first hour. Spread the ads out and one every 10 minutes. That's that's fine. One ad break every 10 minutes. And it's funny because I can end up spreading spreading the ad breaks out over the course of a four hour stream and still have less ad breaks than the default of just spam the first hour with like 50 different ad breaks. Tara cleaning her foot there, as she do. gotten that big of a haul this time, but, you know, at least we're getting a decent amount. We'll have some pocket change left over after we're done... After we're done buying that man his damn expensive-ass booze. What you started. <sighs> it's not a terrible haul, but yeah, I've, I've done better. Just look at this haul. You've got quite some skill. I just got lucky. I didn't get lucky. I just sucked. What are you talking about? And really, while you were there, you could have asked him for the last stamp since we earned it. We get a jacket. We get a jacket. Get your damn jacket, Rio. I'm get a fishing jacket to show how great... <laughs> I'm gonna show up to Shenhua wearing the new fishing jacket. <laughs> And I'll be like, yeah, still working on finding your dad. You know, you know how it is. <laughs> Dads disappear, hard to find. Uh, lost my dad a while ago. He's dead, Rio. Yeah, yeah. Everything that might have happened to your dad, I'm just saying. Just saying. Maybe we're wasting our time here. Maybe we should concern ourselves with other things. Still looking to see if there's any herbs to pick. If any grew back, I guess. I don't know. I don't see nothing. You'd think there'd be oibs. Just oibin around. Like, hello, Rio. Hello, Rio. It's been... It's been 12 hours. I grew back and I'm ripe. Come pick me. Make some money. Get, get out of it. Her foot was on the control key. That's what the problem was. Era. Okay. We're good. She still hates us. Fine. We got the information we needed anyway. We just need to beat the guy's asses, which means we need the martial arts training, which means we need the booze. Which means I went fishing for a lot of money to be able to afford the booze. Which worked! We have the money. 
we can afford the booze. But I want the jacket. <laughs> Get the booze in a second. First jacket. Loud ass frogs. Which they tend to be. Hey, Huang! I caught one. Awesome. You got all the stamps. Here is your special Huang's Tackle original jacket. Thanks. We've got lots of events planned. So stop by whenever you've got time. I'll come again later. Wait. Sorry, bud. Rentals are done for the day. You've got to come earlier if you want to fish. Okay, I'll come again earlier then. But... Ah, we got we got our fishing jacket. We are swanky, swanky in our fishing jacket. Like Shenhua. Oh, I haven't found, <laughs> haven't found, <laughs> have not found your dad yet. I'm sorry. Uh, I've been working hard on that. I swear. <laughs> no pulser tonight. Six hour stream. I don't know about that far. I don't know about that. I still have to worry about studying my Japanese. Still got a lot of that to go. Got a long road ahead. Oh. Yeah. Oof. Yeah, yeah, sorry, I haven't found your dad yet. Check out this jacket! There's a, there's a really nice design on the back of it. Nice, 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 nice. Good, good. I like it. Da -da 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 -da. Okay. While we at it, see about buying up the booze. I haven't had to eat, interestingly enough. My, I haven't been practicing my kung fu, so I haven't been eating. I haven't been needing to. So we have a, that. That kind of that kind of spoils the idea of the eat garlic every time I eat garlic stream. I haven't eaten garlic a single time this whole, whole stream. We've been going at this game for an hour and 48 minutes. I would have been sitting here with an open jar of pickled garlic and just not... not friggin... <laughs> just don't fish during the challenge? Yeah, practice... It'll have to be a point where we're doing some kung fu and practicing and all that fun stuff. Now, do I buy the booze, or do I just come home without anything and just be like, yeah. I feel like buying the booze, I'll have something to talk about. But at the same time, I just like the idea of just coming home with no progress made and wearing this jacket. Excuse me. What is it? I'm here to shop. Hmm. What do you need? Some expensive-ass booze. God damn, that's some expensive ass booze. <sighs> we do need to work up our endurance. It's two levels behind our attack. What will you do with such an expensive item? This isn't something for someone as young as you. I know, but I absolutely need it. Well, that's fine, I suppose. Yes, it's getting late. I should head to Shenhua. 
It's gotten so dark. Maybe I should head back to Shenhua's house. Let's see. Bring Lao Zhu to soon. Okay, I got the Lao Zhu. Now let's go home to Shenhua. And we can just get drunk on it. Like, yeah! It's gonna be great. Hey, Shenhua. What? I managed to find some 50-year-old Lao Zhou. Just fished it Great. up. Great. Did you give it to Soon? Not yet. I'd better get to him soon, though. <laughs> I better get to Soon yes. soon. Yeah. Huh? Finding 50-year-old Lao Zhou was harder than I thought. I'm curious. Where did you end up finding it? At the fucking general store. I found it in the corner of Tao's, covered in dust. It must have cost a fortune. Yeah. I had no idea you could charge so much for liquor. Luckily, he gave me a discount. <laughs> they all say that. Just imagine if he hadn't. He didn't. I don't even want to think about that. <laughs> I should be able to get Mr. Sun to teach me his technique now. Don't overdo it, Leo. We can't rush this. Oh, I haven't. But we can't sit back and relax either. I have. I've got to get to the hermit's nest. I know, but... I'm fine, Shenhua. Trust me. Okay. Uh, it's 1987 and it's 2000 Juan, so it's like four hundred dollars. Four hundred nineteen eighty-seven dollars. Ah, uh, we speak now. Do you like my fishing jacket? Hey, Shenhua. Mm -hmm. Do you want to keep talking? I like to fish. There are a lot of animals here. Like cows and chickens? I was thinking of myself. Not just those. Wild animals, too. Eh? Uh, yes. We've got rabbits, deer, bears, wolves, birds, fish. You name it. It's incredible. So many different kinds. No, there are only two types of animals. Huh? What do you mean? Animals you can eat. And animals you can't. That's it. Oh, oh so one right. kind, I guess. Listen, <laughs> Leo. I want to hear more about you. Yeah? What's up? What's your favorite animal? To eat? Hmm. Favorite animal. Cow, chicken, fish. I guess, yeah, to eat. Well, I am Japanese. I'm very Japanese, and I am here in my fishing jacket. <laughs> so I think... I think sakana. Sakana this. I like the big fish in the pond here. What pond? Every pond. Oh, the one by the tackle shop. It's teeming with fish, right? So it would seem. Well, not anymore, eh? Nobody's seen the really big one, though. Wait, there's a bigger one? <laughs> yes. They call it the King of Bailu. Wait. <laughs> the King of Bailu. Sounds impressive. Tell me there's a legendary fish for me to but catch. But I don't think I could catch it, much less cook it for you. You'll cook it for Wait, me if I catch it? What? I don't really want to eat yes, it. Yes, I do. You don't? I just don't want to cook it. I'm Japanese. <laughs> hey, Shenhua. Hmm? Do you want to keep talking? Where's that fish? Tell me. Have you ever thought about the world beyond Bailu? <sighs> Why do you ask? Yi Moi over in Sunset Hill said she wants to leave. Really? She said that? Yeah. So I wondered if you'd ever thought about it. Honestly, I haven't. Ah, okay. Even if I did, it wouldn't be by choice. I'd have to drag you out of here is what you're telling me. Well, challenge accepted. No? The time has come. That was almost a mantra with my father. He said that everything that happens is not by choice, but fate. That's one way to look at it. Listen, Leo. I want to hear more about you. Yeah? What's up? Have you been to any countries besides China? No. 
Just China. You've been to Japan. Do you like it here? Mm. I've met a lot of great people and seen a lot of unique things. I'm glad martial arts are alive and well here too. Are there any other countries you'd like to visit? Hmm. Let me think. Okay, if a sequel for this, where would it take place? So would it be like Mongolia? Most likely scenario. Uh, America? Or Canada? Well, Canada is where my... My, uh... My girlfriend I failed with in the first game ran off to. So we could track her down and beat up her Monty boyfriend. Or we could go to America and... It'd be like, okay, Los Angeles or or New York. Which one? Which one will Shenmue 4 take place in? Mm. You think maybe Ryo's a Texabu? Maybe he wants to go to Texas? <laughs> That's the most expression on Ryo's face all game. Legendary fish? Ah. Uh, the Mongolia... New York or Montreal? Choice number one knows he becomes a violent stalker. Mm. Mongolia? I don't know why Mongolia. I just think it's like down the road from Bailu Village. Like. It's, uh, Mongolia is. That's still in Russia, right? Like, that's not China, that's Russia, Mongolia. I don't, I'm not, I, I don't know how to, how to geography. Does Landy have a headquarters in Mongolia? Yeah, I'm, that's keeping it, like, in the Asian area. Like, I, I, I believe more Landy has connections in Mongolia than connections in Canada. Uh, but, I don't know. You're from Quebec, please take Canada for you, you French, friendly French-Canadian stranger. Uh, Mongolia is between China and Russia. Mongolia is independent country. Okay, okay. I don't geography. All I know is, 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 like, Mongolian beef. I, 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 I know food. That's about it. And even then, most of it is all made up. Like French dressing, or Russian dressing, or Italian dressing, or American dressing that I only ever saw when I left America. Canada, maybe. Because of Harasaki? Wait, I told you that story? Several times. <laughs> I, I have not. Have I? Gotcha. Oh, okay. Yeah. Wait, uh, what do you mean? Did she really get one up on you that e easily? She just named the. Uh. Hey, Xinhua. Hmm? Do you want to keep talking? I've heard the Phoenix Mirror contains the location of some sort of treasure. Really? I also heard it causes Armageddon, but that was the first game that said that one. But you need the Dragon Mirror in order to find it. That's what someone named Zhu Yuan Da said. Do you want the treasure? No. I'm not interested in any treasure. I just want to know why these mirrors were worth killing my father over. Hi, Dio. <laughs> then, I'll take on Lan Di. All this for some treasure. No, for revenge. I... It was like the, the little Hyrio in the middle there, just like. Huh? <laughs> if this treasure makes people kill, if it breeds hatred. Hey, Shenhua. Then it shouldn't exist. That's why it was hidden away in the first just, place. Just in the middle of this. But people are looking for it anyway, continuing the cycle of pain. Hey, hey Shenhua. Yeah. It's pretty twisted, huh? Is nothing sacred anymore? Leo, this is my treasure. It's a what is plant. It? It's an amber charm my father gave me. Oh, it's me. not in frame yet. 
Wow, that's beautiful. Sometimes he finds amber in the quarry. Did you not make a 3D model so for this? So he chipped some off and made me this. Made you what? Leo, that's treasure enough for me. I can see why. I can't. It's not. It a... looks as though he put a lot of work I'm into it. Glad that. you can tell. <laughs> there was no. There was no. <laughs> I still have some cleaning up to do. Oh. You should get some rest. Thanks. I will. I'm making faces at you all night long. Yeah. yeah. What's up? There's a game that's taking Bailu by storm right now. Want to play? What kind of game? It's called Face Off. What kind of name is that? Okay, I'll play. <laughs> I wish that we had, like, I don't know. Face Off. Ready. Super Mario Set. Brothers or something? Rock. Scissors. Maybe we could play Pong. Does she have a Pong machine? Ah, like, won. they had those at this time. Your face. <laughs> like, well, they had much oh, more no, advanced. I'm like, the NES came out in 1983. Head. We're in 1987. But we're in China, so I don't know what they had Ready. exactly there. Set. Paper. Scissors. Fuck! I win. That was a hideous face, by the way. <laughs> what is the Ouch. point of this dumb game? We talking so, about Shenmue or again? Face Off? Face Off. Ready. Set. Scissors. Scissors. Mm -hmm. Huh? It's a tie, then. You're good at this. So are you. It's getting late. We should stop for today. Wow. Yeah, it is late. We can play again tomorrow. For sure. Okay, we'll play with Shenhua tomorrow. <laughs> we both suck. All right. Save my game. And now we sleep. Off goes the fishing jacket. Down in bed we lay. Jeans and all, never changing. Leo, wake up. Get your ass up. It's the morning. Oh, right. So it is. So it is. Rock, paper, scissors. Okay, gotta get that booze to the... Can I drink the booze right now? Just... No, it's in the key items instead of the food. Dang it, I was wondering if I could just drink the booze. But no, I'm not allowed to drink booze. I'm Ryo Hazuki. I'm a good boy. Good morning, Ryo. Good morning. Did you get enough rest? Yeah. That's all that matters. Can I talk to her at all, like, past that? So... Hey, yeah. Hey. Hi, Ryo. Are you leaving already? Yes. I am. I have to get Mr. Soon to train me. Yan Xing's depending on us. I understand. Be careful out there, Leo. Uh, okay, well, we actually had a little bit more to talk about, so. Ooh. <laughs> the lady at the store told me about a new game we can play. She called it Hissy Face. Hey, Leo. Hmm? Good luck. Be sure to come back before it gets too dark. I understand. Of course. I don't understand a damn thing. Okay, to Village Square. Okay, make ourselves down towards... Or sunflower placinator. Get our new move. Uh, hand over the booze. Get our new move, and then practice with cute martial artist lady for a while. Do a lot of do a lot of horse stancing to to strengthen our groinular area, and boom, we'll be ready to take on Mister. I can beat you in a cutscene, even though we're technically all ready to take him on. But now we'll be allowed to beat him. He 
These cutscenes are pointless, Jovat? No, no, no. They they help establish the mood, build character. <clears throat> How am I supposed to really connect if I don't know that every single morning Shenhua asks Ryo if he got enough rest and he's there like, yep. And that's the extent of their conversation. If I don't see that, how am I supposed to truly connect? Sunflowers, call you on the back. Did this game become Yakuza? Um... They showcase the excellent voice acting. That's right, that's right. I'm remembering that a lot better now. Chicken. Niwatori. Yard bird. Niwatori. You still got booze. What you need more booze for? You need you need more booze that bad soon. Does ya? Do you still drinking the same stuff I got you? you? You haven't even touched the bun. You just holding on to it. It's gotta be cold by now. It's been like a week. Yeah, I'm talking to you. Mr. Sun. Would you like this 50-year-old lounge? <sighs> I had that in my back pocket the whole time. This better be the real deal. Does it not look like it? <laughs> Guess I'll know after a swig. You won't know well, a damn thing! Next. What? There's more? Is there a problem? Because I can stop. <sighs> I'll do it. God damn it! No, Ryo! No! Kick his ass! Mr. Sun, please. Please teach me your technique. Come back once you have defeated White Tiger of Marshall Hall. Then we can talk. Marshall Hall? Who the fuck's so, that? So, you're not going to teach me? Are you already talking back to your venerable teacher? Hmm? If you do not wish to do it, then you needn't do anything. It matters not to me. That's not what I... Uh, right. So I just need to defeat White Tiger. You just need to defeat White Tiger so far. Precisely. Then return here. Understood. <sighs> All right. Beat White Tiger. That's <laughs> not to just beat his ass. Okay. We're gonna beat White Tiger. Get to doing a horse stance? Yeah, we gotta. Gotta practice our horsey stancy. Might need more garlic. We got plenty of garlic. Got 36 garlics on us. We good. We good. How much money we got? 220. Mm. We might need to do some more fishing. But we got garlic. Let's see about catching that legendary fish. Of legend. That's, that's, that's what I'm interested in. What pond is that legendary fish in? Where does it hang out in the pond? Gotta catch the giant ass legendary Bailu god fish thing of this, the fish god. Defeat White Tiger. And Marshall Hall, the, the the one that was along the way? Boys, uh, we got two dojos here. But I think it's just like the one where I'm allowed to beat people's asses. I got a list of all the people that work there. So as long as I can figure out which one says White Tiger, I should be... Should be good.
Nothing else, he fits the grouchy Chinese movie master archetype. Yeah. I, he absolutely just loves wasting my fucking time. <laughs> now I have to come back to Shenhua like, I gave him the booze and he still didn't teach me. Don't worry, we'll... F we'll find your dad. <laughs> somewhere, somehow. Was trying to see if I can spot any herbs to shove in my back pocket. And he is gonna kick your ass if your name is White Tiger at Marshall Hall. Marshall Hall. See if there's a way further down this way from that way. Just in case. There ain't, there ain't, there's nothing there. No way, no how, nothing. <sighs> okay, so I can double blow everyone here. It's gonna be great. First, though, I gotta practice my horsiness. First, though, I gotta eat some garlic. Horse dance, huh? Maybe I'll give it a shot. Yeah, our, our endurance is a little bit behind our ass kicking power. So we gotta. Gotta work on that. Gotta work on that. Practice. Specifically, the crotch muscles. Hey, is there anything past Horse Stand Seven? I don't see a bar. It just says Horse Stand Seven Master. Um, hmm. This might not actually uh, be uh, doing much for us anymore. Our crotch might be as powerful as it's going to be. Level 7 is a weird one to be the one to be like, that's max level. <laughs> but... It looks like it. It doesn't even seem like we're running low on endurance here. We're just... We're just... fast as the horse stance. Keep going? No, 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 we can't go any further beyond. We... I'll save it for later. <laughs> I'll save it for when I get back to Shen. Who else? Okay, well, what about the one inch punch? One inch punch. Maybe I'll give it a shot. I gotta wait till slightly after they touch. Maybe not, I don't... Hmm. 
Yeah, that, that absolutely did not work. God dang it. Okay. We're getting there. We're getting there. My timing's improving, I hope. Seems like it. Okay, so that's working up our endurance. So we gotta, gotta work on our punchy. Should I keep going? Yes. Yes. Our endurance is, like, terrible. We gotta... Yeah, <laughs> Yeah, that, this ain't a one-inch punch, true. Like, he, he's moving his arm a hell of a lot. He's moving his whole arm is kind of kind of a thing. Like, that's, that's not one inch. You can't start from one inch, back up, then run up, and bow. Like, that's not a one-inch punch. It's just a punch. Now, practicing your punching ain't exactly a terrible idea. Uh, Bruce Lee was said to practice punching, like, a thousand punches a day. Now, the one-inch punch, though, was different from just a punch. One-inch punch was kind of a parlor trick. But... And it's just, you know, guy stand there, get a big, strunk guy, have him just stand there. Yeah, you, you, you have the, your fist lined up with his chesticles, and you just have one inch of distance between the physical and the chesticle, and you shift your weight forward, shift your body forward, pulling your arm back, and then push hard, effectively, and it's just because of their stance and the level of pressure offered because Bruce Lee was still a strong guy. It'll knock their ass, knock them on their ass. And that's just kind of a parlor trick. It has no real practical application. But it's like, hey, look at this. With a mere one inch of space to punch this guy, I can knock him down. Look at that. It had more to do with the fact that they were not in a stance to resist the force. It would hit them. It, it would just push them over because they'd be standing flat against it. That's, that's part of the trick of the one-inch punch. God dang it. God dang it. Okay. All right, all right. Should I keep going? Maybe later. There are seven stages in horse stance, seven stages in one-inch punch, and seven stages in rooster steps, making maxing out at 21 endurance levels. Okay. I was not... I was not uh, aware of rooster steps. Okay, you're all looking it One up. inch punch. Maybe I'll give it a shot. Old man. Old man. Starting to lose my composure. Oh, gotta focus. Good like fat body, small, but fat body child. But Okay, 
Yeah, the second kanji there is punch, but the first one... Then it's just measure, I think, like... There's a con... Eh. Should I keep going? Wouldn't it be wise to use both hands so you can use either if a fight happens? I mean, there's that, but they could be like, man, watch this guy's right hook, or right jab, for that rather. That's the only, the only ability, is the right jab. like child, but it's lacking the slash across the middle. Should I keep going? It's just the... <laughs> hmm. What is that, then? Yes, I have seen that before, but I don't think I've been taught that. I'm thinking of it in other fonts. Like, yes, I've definitely seen that one. Various... Japanese text, but I don't know it. with how strong Ryo's right hand is. You're gonna be asking Ryo what he must have been doing for, uh, to, to, for his right hand to be this strong, and he's gonna look her in the face and gonna be like, practicing. Huh? Yeah. I practice using my right hand a lot. Should I keep going? How often do you practice, Ryo? Every day. It's just like the hot... I always think of the hot martial artist lady when I do. It was part of the Wuju she taught me. Before she kicked me out of her house. Dead proud. Become the master of double blow. Should I keep going? What are you asking me for? You should, should eat your garlic. Maybe later. You should eat your garlic, Rio. Ah, just thinking how much garlic I could have been eating punch. now if I did get that Maybe garlic. Give it a shot. Mm, dang it. Dang it. Missed opportunities. Missed opportunities. There we go. Well, since, since it maxes out at 7, I figure, you know what? Maybe just 
Maybe just practice our one-inch punch, max out our endurance, not have to worry about it anymore until we gain access to whatever the rooster step is. My fingers. It's fine. I practiced a lot with my right hand. I beat some very hard wood. Maybe I'll practice some more. Practice beating wood, Rio? Yes. I could only do that if the wood was hard. need two. I would need two holes if I wanted to be able to properly practice double love. doing a kind of one-inch punch here. Okay. Okay. Now it's actually looking like a one-inch punch. He's been... He worked himself some more. from further away to the one-inch. You'd think maybe starting at the one-inch would help you get good at the one-inch. But now he, he, he was doing the far, far punch. And now... Now, at level six, we're actually one inch in it. Well, not quite one inch in. We're still at, like, six inches. But it beats the hell out of the four-foot punch. I wonder if rank seven will actually be one inch. Food is Maybe I'll practice some more. Yes, you will. You can eat later. Rio. Since I gotta have the reaction time for this, because it's just it kind of speeds up and slows down as it coming it's coming together. Going. Well, now we gotta eat. We gotta stop for our lunch. Never mind. One inch punch. Maybe I'll give it a shot. Maybe I will. 
Ah, uh, there it is. Dreaming. You see, the feats was twitching a bit. That is a calm butterfly. That butterfly just don't care. Guy right here, he just pounding away at that, and the butterfly just cruising along like, yeah, yeah, we're fine. I, I'm smacking the butterfly with the pole now. It just, okay, it is a ghost butterfly. Thought it looked familiar. It's one of the ones from the Mansion of the Hidden Souls. Also, a slightly different pose. A little bit more than one inch. Uh, but... It's actually... Maybe I'll practice some more. It's actually... A lot, uh, a lot closer. We, we actually, like, we don't back up at all this time. We, we have our hand out and then we do a punch. That's why our one inch punch didn't look like a one inch punch before. It's because we sucked at it. the speed it just does my head in should I keep going yes we haven't mastered yet almost there almost there yo and then we can finally finish the never one inch punch again Just punch the shit out of it. Maybe I'll practice some more. Well, we got it, cause you're still not mastered. Huh? Now are you? Keep going. Keep going, real. Master it like the master that you should be. Experience bar. Ah, dang it. There we go. We have mastered one inch punch. Now our stance is the same as it was before going up right seven, so there's no extra animation of that.
Should I keep going? I'll save it for later. All right. Now let's have some lovely, lovely, delicious garlic. Okay, all right. Master the uh, horsey stancy, the uh, punchy punchy, one 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 inchy. Now where the hell is White Tiger? Ah, uh, shit, 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 shit. Oh god, this is. I should start by reaching first one. Oh. Which is Master. Well, I did that, not, not, not it, then, uh... Okay. So we got first time... Ooh, what's that? Uh. Oh, yeah, that... That's, uh, kanji. It's not the kanji for one, but the kanji for first time. So, like, beginner, first time, voyaging, you know, that fun stuff. Uh, then we got two, three, four, five. First Duan. Yeah, where the hell White Tiger? Got black something. Blue something. White something. That's probably the something's probably Tiger. Probably. Yellow. Okay. What the hell? That's red. Okay. Well, it's not red. That's crimson. But like, red is Aki. That's that's crimson. I can't remember how to pronounce it right. Or, or Aki Aka. Aka. Anyway, anyway. Ah, uh, these names. Anyway, I've gotta, I gotta rank up quite a bit to beat White Tiger. He's in the fourth fucking ranks there. So we gotta beat, have a lot of asses that we gotta beat. Excuse me. Hmm. Here to train? Have you come to spar or fight one of the monks? I'd like to kick Which all of their be? asses. A fight? Very well. At your level, Red Tiger should be a good match. Yeah, but I gotta fight White Tiger. But this first one, Red Tiger. Take the double blow. Double blow. Okay. Double blew the yes. shit out of him. Well done. That's enough to raise your rank. <laughs> he can only Thank take you. a couple double blows. Do not get complacent. You must aim ever higher. You say so. Excuse me. Hmm. Here to train? Have you come to spar? Or fight one of the I'm just monks. here to beat the shit out of Which all of your be? students. So you wish to fight? I believe Black Tiger will give you an appropriate challenge. I don't think so. I think I'm just gonna kick his ass too. Take the double blow! Stop blocking my double blow and take the double blow. What's with this guy? <laughs> okay, he that took three double blows. Match. I didn't think you'd defeat him. Your rank has been You didn't raised. think I'd defeat that guy? I'm Keep just double blowing your work. kids and then uh, no wait. That came out wrong. Excuse me. I'm double blowing hmm. your students. Here to train? That also didn't sound Have right. Have you come to spar or fight one of the monks? I'm double blowing Which your men. Will it be? I'm double blowing your men. 
And they they just You're cannot handle fight. it. They 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 it's just I think you will find spent. Blue Tiger a most formidable opponent. Yeah, you can take a double blow pretty well. That will work. Stop that tickles. Is that all you're made of? Yeah, pretty much. Not a chance. Too bad. That won't work. Not a chance. Got you. There we go. Well done. You defeated Blue Tiger. And I did. Your rank rises without objection. Thank you. But this is not the end. Far from it. Damn right, I gotta ki kick White Tiger's ass still. Excuse me. Hmm. Here to train? Have you come to spar or fight one of the monks? Which will it be? You certainly like to fight. Then you shall face our best warrior. His name is White Tiger. Now He's then, the best? He's only victory. ranked four. There's five ranks, and there's also the master side over the... And he's not even wearing... I mean, he's wearing some white, but he's got white and gold. He's like... He's gaudy tiger, okay? Pretty simple, just just double blow, that's like all I do. Kick your it's ass been next. Some time since I've had such a fine trainee. That means just one more opponent stands in your way. Who? Him, probably. Okay. And beat down. First, let me just top myself off. There we go. That's nice. That's nice. I'm interested. Who's the last one? Excuse me. Hmm. Here to train? Can Have I become the master of this, dun of this dojo? Of monks. Which will it be? So, you've chosen to fight? Then I shall be your opponent. Okay. You'll need a new strategy this time. I don't know. I'm going to still no try just me. double blows for days. Let's see how it goes. Gold Tiger. Man. Good enough. I'm gonna take your job. Okay, old strategy seems to be working fine. Attempted murder. <laughs> oh, jeez. Damn, he broke through my defense. He got some strong attacks. Whew. Okay, he, he kicking my ass pretty hardcore. So I gotta be careful. Okay. 
I'm impressed. Is that all you're made of? Almost. He almost got me too. Can't get cocky. Don't disappoint me. Yeah. How did you manage to? I double blew the I shit out of you. you. You are now the top ranked fighter. No. I still have a ways to go. No, I kicked everyone's ass That's there. That's right. Maintain that mindset. Do not give in to pride. I won't. <laughs> Too late. I'm, I'm the double blow master. Hell yes. Now I could really go for some garlic. <laughs> oh. Still need land D rank? True. True. Okay. Let me like, okay, I beat White Tiger and I did one better. I kicked the, the, the sensei's ass too. And the guy's gonna be there like, I didn't ask you to beat him! Alright, you failed. I'm not teaching you. <laughs> oh. Landy, Dwan rank 34. Oh god. <laughs> 34th Duong. Forklift man, forklift it up again. Forklift man, forklift man, walking around the town. Excuse me, guys. Excuse me, I got... You're doing a great job here, but I gotta thank you. Uh, how's it going, uh, uh, TJ Schneider? I'm uh, doing all right. I just kicked everyone's ass in the dojo, stuffed my face with some garlic, mastered the one-inch punch, found out I was already mastered horse dance last time. I didn't pay enough attention to realize that it didn't go any higher than I got it. Uh, caught a bunch of fish, made a lot of money, spent it all on booze, and now I'm trying to get the drunken, homeless martial arts master to teach me more moves because evidently being able to kick all of those asses isn't isn't good enough because the guy I'm trying to beat can kick my ass in a cutscene so I need the specific skill to be able to beat him like it doesn't matter if I get his health all the way down it just cuts to the cutscene and he wins so I was like damn it damn it <laughs> heard you beat up the old man we're arresting you for assault <laughs> he just couldn't handle my double blow None of his students could handle it. I double blew the shit out of everyone in that dojo. They speak of the day. They speak of the day that the, the, the kid from Japan showed up and just double blew everyone away. the sunflowers, the old rustic dojo, the old abandoned temple. They find the guy squatting there and they'll be like, please teach me now. I got you your booze and I kicked all the asses and took all the names. That is interesting. The the, the uh, chickens here are in the courtyard of the temple. The, the Niwa. Niwa Tori.
庭は庭で庭は通りをあります。Uh, to, to, to give a more straight translation of that sentence,、uh, courtyard inside or courtyard within, chickens exist. Just saying, there are chickens in the courtyard. So, soon, I kicked the ass. Mr. Son. And more asses. Beat it. I did.、What? The sun's about to set. There's nothing we can do today. Are you shitting me, you shit shitter? That's not. I can refuse you tomorrow, too. Fine. And、Last、so you will. Tomorrow. I'll come a little earlier. I'll head home for now. Ah,、uh, Shenhua? Mr. Soon is a dicky bag and I don't like him. Let's play face off for six hours. Just double blowing and doing, doing everything I can. I, I, became a, I became a master beta. I did double blows for everyone willing to be double blown by me. And this, this old guy still won't freaking won't freaking teach me his moves. Oh, now that shouldn't be.、Uh, it's just, it should, it really shouldn't. I, there, there, there's a clear. I, I, have, I have worked hard for this, and he will not. He, he's, he's treating me like fucking YouTube over here, just like fuck you every chance he gets. I'm like, God damn it. <laughs> My watch is gonna beep any second now. I'm gonna, like, like what, what if I, how about I can run home faster? If I can run home faster, then the dang watch goes off. It wears down my stamina. But. It worked. Maybe. Just jump it. Jump it, Rio. Just jump down the damn. Okay. Gotta go. Nah, I'm not gonna make it. Watch it gonna go off. <sighs> This is the old man tomorrow. Go away! It's too early! It's gotten so dark. Probably. Maybe I should head back to Shenhua's house. That's what we're doing, Ryo. I could, I could make it faster running than I can with fast travel. Fast travel will be like I show up at nine. I'm like, nah, I'm not, I'm not taking that long. I'm, I'm gonna get there. I'm gonna get there. Shenhua gonna be waiting for me, and she's gonna be like, oh my god, Ryo, you're home so early. And I'm gonna be like, yes, it's, it's great. Now let's make faces at each other. And we're gonna make faces all night long. It's gonna be great. Shenhua, I'm back. Hello. Oof. Hey, Shenhua. How did it go? It's、um, shitty. Well. What's wrong? Did Mr. Sun refuse to teach you his technique? I, um. I'm not really sure. You're not sure? No. You gotta explain it, Ryo! 
He told me to defeat okay. someone called White Tiger at Marshall Hall. Marshall Hall? Yeah. He told me to come back once I'd done so. I see. I managed to defeat White Tiger. I'll go see Mr. Soon again tomorrow. He'll have to teach me his technique now. Okay. Well, you're gonna leave out the part where you went to him and he just told you to just fuck I off? I just know Mr. Soon is going to teach me his signature technique. How do you know that, Ryo? Me too. How do you know that, Shenhua? But what? What? I'm just not sure I can trust him. So you don't Slow know. Down, Leo. What? What? Whoa, whoa. What do you mean? Just focus on what you can control and take things one step at a time. Yeah. Yeah, you're right. She's kind of. She got tired of our shit. <laughs> yeah, like, okay, hold the fuck up. Game won't continue until Mr. Soon says yes. Xinhua. I still have some cleaning up to do. Why don't you head on to bed? All right then. Shenhua, you know me better than that. You know what time it is. It's Leo. Face What's off time. Up? There's a game that's taking Bailu by storm right now. Want to play? What kind of game? It's called Face Off. What kind of name is that? Face. Okay, off. I'll play. We have the longest face-off game ever. Face-off. We came. Ready. We came home Set. early. She had nothing to say. Paper. Scissors. Now we get to face off for four oh, hours. That was a hideous face, by the way. What? Well, ouch. <laughs> so, want to play again? Yes. Face off. Yes, Shanwa. Well, we have face off and Set. Scissors. Scissors. What is that face? Don't make me laugh. I could say the same to you. Okay, it's a tie. One more round. Let's go. Okay, here goes. Face off. Ready. Set. Scissors. Scissors. What is that face? Don't just, make me laugh. Just scissor in here. I could say right the here. same to just, you. Yeah. Okay, it's a tie. One more round. Let's go. Just play the double blow. <laughs> okay, here goes. He has paper. I'm, I have double blow. <laughs> Set. Scissors. Paper. Ha! I won. Your face. <laughs> oh no, I'm not letting you quit while you're ahead. One more game. Face off. Ready. Set. Rock. Scissors. Ha! Ha! I won. Your face. <laughs> oh no, I'm not letting you quit while you're ahead. One more game. Face off. Ready. Set. Paper. Paper. Rock. Ha! I'm kicking her ass. Ha, I won. Your face. <laughs> oh no, I'm not letting you that's, quit that's, while that's you're That's ahead. my my goal. One I'm going game. to just defeat everyone in Bailu Village at everything. I kicked those kids asses in hide and seek. Ready. I kicked the Set. dojo's asses in martial arts. And I'm kicking Scissors. kicking Shenhua's ass. Scissors. At face off. What is that face? Don't make me laugh. I could say the same to you. Okay, it's a tie. One more round. Let's go. Let's go. Okay, here goes. Face off. Ready. Set. Scissors. Paper. Haha. <laughs> ha, I won. Your face. <laughs> game oh, used no, to go I'm rock, paper, you scissors, while you're bomb. Ahead. One more game. Well, I'm not sure exactly what beats bomb. Face off. But I also don't know exactly what Ready. face you would make for bomb. Set. Would you just go like scanners? Just <laughs> paper, scissors. Damn it! She scissored me. I win. That was a hideous face. Good by night, the way. Fushigaru. Whoa. Good night, good night. Ouch. So, want to play again? Face off. 
You can face Ready. off forever. Set. Face off five hours. Rock. Rock. 24 hour face off stream. What is that face? Don't make me laugh. I could say the same to you. Okay, it's a tie. One more round. Let's go. We're gonna wake up in the morning and we're just gonna. Okay, here goes. Go right to talking to Shenhua and we're just gonna play face off Ready. all fucking Set. day. <laughs> That's gonna be the entire. The entire Scissors. day. Rock. Damn it. I win. That was a hideous face, by the way. Uh, thank the video. Well, yeah, hope you have a great ouch. time with the game and wonderful weekend. So, thank you, Valage. Thank you, thank again? you. I'm having an face interesting off. time making Ready. faces at Shenhua. Set. Rock. Paper. She cheating. I win. <laughs> that was a hideous face, by the way. What? Ouch. So, want to play again? Face off. Ready. Set. Scissors. Scissors. What the? Hi, Dio. Shenhua. <laughs> we made the same face. So we did. Okay, here goes. Face off. Ready. Set. Scissors. Rock. Damn it. I win. That was a hideous face, by the way. What? Ouch. So, want to play again? Face off. Ready. Set. Scissors. Paper. Ah. Ha! I won. Your face. <laughs> oh no, I'm not letting you quit while you're ahead. One more game. I wonder if it is actually possible for the time Face to run off. out and her to be like, that's it. Set. After she loses. Or does she always just sit there like, no! Scissors. No. Paper. Ha, and if I keep I winning won. and going to face. like <laughs> eight in the morning. Oh no, I'm not letting you quit while you're ahead. One more game. Face off. Ready. Set. Paper. Paper. What is that face? Don't make me laugh. I could say the same to you. Okay, it's a tie. One more round. Let's go. But... Okay, here see, goes. There, there is a method to the madness. There is a Ready. method to the madness. You gotta Set. understand. You gotta understand. The more Rock. time we spent talking Paper. with... Uh, talking with Shenhua here, a hideous face, the more the she's been warming what? up and like coming Ouch. closer to the room and saying so, like hey and then saying and, and waving us goodbye as we face off as we leave and now Ready. she comes out and like runs Set. up to us to say goodbye we leave so you see and she comes Scissors. into the room and she Rock. and she <laughs> I win that was a hideous face by the way she comes she comes what? into the room Ouch. and she touches us to wake so, us up want to play again so <laughs> yes Jovad, yes playing the long con Set. So it seems like a Scissors. complete waste of time to just sit Rock. here and. Uh, <laughs> I win. That was a hideous. Face, just make by faces the way. at each other, but. Ouch. I believe that. So want to Behind the scenes, as all, all, all the cogs of the game work face as off. they do, Ready. Shenhua and Ryo's var variable for the closeness Paper. of their relationship Rock. is ha, I won. slowly. Your face. Slowly but surely <laughs> increasing. Oh no, I'm not letting you quit while you're ahead. And therefore, if there's any more things that Shenhua and Ryo Ready. do when Set. their relationship is at a high enough level, then those things Paper. shall happen. Paper. Whereas if I wasn't sitting here making faces at her for hours and it's hours, tie, then. then that's you're content that I would miss. So are you. I wouldn't get the whole experience of okay, Shenmue 3. Here goes. Face off. If I don't Ready. spend at Set. least half the game time Rock. doing this. Rock. Huh? It's a tie then. You're good at this. So are you. Okay, here goes. Face off. Ready. Set. <sighs> but it helps to have something Scissors. besides. Scissors. God damn, we just did three tie in a what row. What is that face? Don't make me laugh. Better help to have something I could say the other same to you. 
than okay, face off to talk tie. about. One more round. Let's go. Okay, here goes. Face off. Ready. Set. Paper. Scissors. Damn it! I win. That was a hideous <sighs> face, by the way. What? Ouch. So, want to play again? Now, I don't think that uh, Ryo's goal is Ready. that. I'm, I, I, I just think... And I also don't think that's a, a possibility. <laughs> I just... Uh, Hi, Ryo. Shenhua. I'm interested in seeing what other <laughs> scenes appear face. like in game. Like so I don't believe that they're actually going to get down and okay, dirty, and if they do, goes. then it's wrong. Because face Ryo off. is 18 and Shenhua Ready. is 16. Set. It can't give Scissors. me that. They can't give me that. The, the, the game came out. Uh, they, they didn't. Can't t t give me that. The game takes place in 1987 <laughs> in Central China. Excuse. Oh no! no. I'm not letting you quit. While game you're came ahead. out in 2020. They know One what they did. One more game. 2019. 2019. Excuse face me. off. Ready. Yeah, she's Good. she's 16 canonically. Paper. Rock. Ha! Ha! I won. Your face. <laughs> Oh no, I'm not letting you quit while you're ahead. One more game. Face off. Ready. Set. Paper. Paper. <laughs> what the? Hi, Leo. Shenhua. <laughs> we made the same face. So we did. Okay, here goes. Face off. Ready. Set. Rock. Paper. Gah. I win. That was a hideous face, by the way. <sighs> what? Ouch. Hey, just say fuck so, it and leave. So, want to play again? <laughs> we can't. We can't say fuck it and leave. We face have off. to. Ready. We have to spend as much Set. time as possible with Shenhua. Scissors. Scissors. We're scissoring Shenhua. Huh? It's a tie, then. You're evil. <laughs> You're good at this. So are you. No, 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 it's fine, it's fine. We just, okay, we just here goes. might have a few ulterior motives, but... Ready. Set. It's fine. We just spend an hours and hours making faces Scissors. at each other. Paper. Ha! I won. <laughs> Your face. <laughs> oh, no. I'm not letting you quit while you're ahead. Ugh. One more game. Shenmue 1 had walking around asking about face sailors. Off. Ready. Shenmu 2 Set. had lucky hits. Shenmu 3 Scissors. has face off. Scissors. <laughs> huh? It's a tie then. You're good at this. So are you. Okay, here goes. Face off. Ready. Set. Scissors. Scissors. Rock. Damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. I win. I should really that stop letting her go second. By the way. <laughs> what? Ouch. So, want to play again? <sighs> Face off. Ready. Set. Paper. Rock. Ha! Ha! I won. Your face. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, I'm not letting you quit while you're ahead. One more game. Face this is off. better than Gwent. <laughs> Ready. Set. Scissors. Rock. Damn it. I win. That was a hideous face, by the way. What? Ouch. So, want to play again? Face off. Does she decide Ready. to go to sleep Set. or does Rio? Well, I could Paper. get up at any time. Paper. And just say I'm going to bed. What the? But if I do that, Hi, then I'm not using Shenhua. the maximum amount of time possible in order to <laughs> improve place. the relationship so variable uh, integer. Okay, here goes. Between Ryo and Shenhua. Set. Therefore, Rock. paper. Goddamn. I win. <laughs> That was a hideous face, by the way. Therefore, I decide well, to keep going Ouch. until... So, want to play again? It's just... I'm just figuring how the variables work Ready. in this. There's definitely a Set. relationship variable. Either that or it's Paper. just coincidence. Rock. 
Just coincidence that she was Your face. being a little bit more friendly the more oh, time no, I spent with her. I'm not with her. letting you quit while you're ahead. One more game. Deku just doesn't want to lose off. her like he did his girlfriend Ready. in Shenmue 1. So. Yeah, I really, I really fucked that up. Pretty bad. Rock. Paper. Damn it. I win. That was a hideous face, by the way. What? Ouch. She, she really mean. She really mean. Okay. It's getting late. We should stop for we, today. We spent, we spent wow. like four hours yeah, it is late. playing. We can play again tomorrow. Attempted for sure. murder. I mean, what what time is it now in in game? Oh, okay. Yeah, it's eleven ten. We started playing face off at like seven twenty. <laughs> so that was goddamn four hours of face off with her. I hope she's happy. <laughs> uh yeah, person. I get that a lot. Funny thing is, I didn't even have the uh, the, the shirt on up like that today. I, I I just got my my normal kind of short. Oh well. Well, not really normal. Just kind of casual-ish, like more casual. Ugh. I like my Hawaiian shirts, but I like them with nice abstract dark dark patterns. To them. That's how I like it. I don't like floral. I don't. It's just like. Yo. But you wake up. <sighs> Still waiting for the it's level morning. beyond just oh, come up and touch me. Right. Like, I'm waiting for her to, like, start, like, running her fingers through my hair. It's like, be like, Rio, it's morning. I've made you a beautiful breakfast. I got steak and eggs. Eggs from Claudia the chicken, not back. And I slaughtered Bessie in the midnight for that steak. I hope you love it. I hope you love it so much, Rio. Well, Bessie. Bessie. Good morning, Leo. Morning. Did you get enough rest? Yeah. Is there anything? Okay, let's talk. Shenhua. What's wrong? I don't know. Are you leaving already? Yes. I am. Yanxing needs our help, and fast. Indeed. I mean, it's been two weeks. Be careful out there, Leo. If we could wait this long, clearly we can keep waiting. Okay, time to go learn this move and probably get jerked around some more. Hey, Rio. Mm -hmm. Good luck. Be sure to come back before it gets too dark. We can play more face-off. Of course. Oh, yeah. Face-off forever. Way. Make our way through the sunflowers again. She wants to cut Rio's face off and wear it when driving. Oh no. Those poor kids never finish their Tai Chi. Ah. It's, it's, it, it, it's, the, Rio is talking about how he still has a long way to go. And it's like, that's right, that's the correct way to think. Teach the kids when they're young. You will never finish. Up the stairs we go, we go. I'm going to learn to double blow. Wait, that's things I already know. I need to learn the other move. Other move. Other move. 
Don't know name of other move. Gonna learn the other move, whatever moves the other move. Yeah. Hehe. <laughs> it's an eclipse. Right, 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 uh... Yeah, oh, come on, Ryo, just stop. There we go, eclipse. Ah, I did it. Anyway. The other moves are reach around and yank technique. Okay, you enjoy your booze and your buns? Mr. Sun, I have defeated White Tiger. <laughs> have you now? And Gold Tiger. You made a promise. In case you care. Teach me your technique. Hmm. Try catching ten of those chickens. Seriously? If you don't want to. How, how, how do you catch the chicken? I don't know how to... But of course we'll catch them. N no, I'll do it. I just have to catch them, right? You're in for a rough day today. What, are they playing chicken hide-and-seek? <laughs> Quick time event, chickens! God dang it! God dang it! No, not quick time event, chicken! Oh. to X, so that's not so bad. Son of a bitch. Yeah, it always went B, X, B, X, B, X, B, X. Ooh, you have some skill. It was pretty simple once the pattern recognition kicked in. You've still a ways to go, but it's clear you are your father's son. What, did he get your KFC or some shit? my father, didn't you? Indeed. This is a photo of him in Bailu Village. Hmm. Is this Iwa with Zhao Sun Ming? So you know about my father and Zhao Sun Ming? Long ago, Fung and I trained together, helping each other to hone our skills. Practice right, double blowing each other. As a result of our training, Fung went on to gain great renown among our fellow martial artists. Many gifted students came to study under him, revering him as their master. Zhao and your father were among them. They got along famously under Fung's tutelage. They pushed each other to new limits. Then, several years later, Zhao Sun Ming died mysteriously. But what of Iwa? What became of your father? Oh, he died he not so mysteriously. Ah, he... oh, I see. I don't know shit. Mr. Sun. I'm done for the day. Go back and get some rest. We keep up with your training. You hear me? Got it. Done what? We didn't do anything! You just talked a little- Maybe I should head back to Shenhua's house. It's not even 10 in the morning! For the day, it <laughs> old man just triple blowed me. Yeah, jeez. <sighs> well, I ain't spending twelve hours playing 
face off. Shenhua, I, I like to spend time with your butts. Uh, I, I could also see about making some money again so that I'm not so fucking broke. Maybe catch that legendary fish that everyone was talking about. The, the Bailu Blaster or whatever the hell, I don't know. Oh, wrong way. I got distracted by cute martial artist lady. I, I don't got no moves to practice on you. I'm sorry, the guy still won't teach me his moves. Nothing to train with you. Being awkward. I'm gonna get kicked out of the village in a second. Eve's butt versus Ryo's butt. Mm -hmm. uh, Ryo got a kind of that Hank Hill ass. I mean, he can't help it. He was originally designed on the Dreamcast, so it didn't really have a lot of... Then again, Joy had some cheeks to her. I remember when when I had that mission to tail the one lady for so long in Shenmue 2, which was really annoying, especially since she ain't got no ass. But then Joy showing up later, and she's there, got the, the junk in the trunk, and I'm like, okay, well, clearly this engine is capable of this. Shenmue style, Shenmue style, uh, King of the Hill kind of game. Just walking up to random people in Ireland, like, what can you tell me about propane and propane accessories? Hello, sir. Thanks for the jacket. And now I need to catch a legendary fish. Pardon me. Aya, you here to fish? First things first, rent your tackle here. So, which one do you want? I will take your most expensive tackle here. This one. You got it. Don't come back empty handed now. Okay. Fish and we will go. Fish and we will go. I hold Elio. Fish and we will go. God, I need some money. <laughs> Leo shouts. <laughs> That's my purse. I don't know you. Kicks him in the schlong. <laughs> I think I can fish here. Alright. Give it a good old fishy fish. And he's hoping. But I just so happen to catch a giant ass legendary. That would be nice. That was that that would be great. Go over to Shenhua and be like, yeah, uh, he still didn't teach me nothing, but I caught a really big fish. It's amazing. Should have been there, Shenhua. No, of course I went to the dojo. Of course I went. I got did you see how much chicken poop I got on me? Absolutely. Absolutely tried. He just ain't they ain't telling me nothing. Ain't told me nothing I didn't already know. Need more clues for big fish? Yeah. Unfortunately, I haven't seen. I guess I, there are, is some ability to talk to people about multiple topics. I just, I'm I'm not certain if there's anyone I can talk to and be like, hey, 
Have you heard of the legendary fish of Bailu? Can you tell me anything about the... Fucking Rain Man. I can ask him. All he talks about is fish. And he's the only fisherman that will talk to me. And all he talks about is fish. He might actually know something. Accidentally catch Shenlong. finished watching Dragon Ball Z again, so we've moved on to the next one in the series, Dragon Ball Super. And... We've, uh... uh it's just... Close it. There's a thing... Oh, yeah. It's, it's the, uh... The differences in the characters and such. Well, they, we got on the topic of... How, you know, Charlie was saying, like, according to a lot of Dragon Ball fans, uh, Videl's entire character just changed personalities drastically after getting married to Gohan. And, yes, yes, that's true. But also, I mentioned that I am of the opinion that best Videl is long hair Videl. Like, before she cut her hair, that was where Videl went from I really like this character to she's downgraded. Uh, Charlie seems to think that short hair Videl was best Videl. Like, long hair Videl is bitch Videl. And short hair Videl was best Videl prior to Mary Gohan Videl. I am of the opinion that Bitch Videl is best Videl. And also she was cuter. That's just my opinion. I don't know, does anyone else have any other opinions about Videl? Probably, but maybe not. I don't know. I don't know if anyone else thinks about it quite this deeply. Like, I don't know if anyone else really cares that much about, hey, which is your favorite Videl? I still like Mr. Satan. And I'm hoping with the new Dragon Ball game coming, get to play as Mr. Satan. And I hope also that they don't give him a like jetpack. I mean I hope that they just have it so he he's not able to fly. Like I don't need him to have a jetpack to fly, he's, he's, a, he's a, a very difficult to use character to say the least. Uh, good luck beating anything with Mr. Safe. But to that end, I feel like it's better to just be more authentic and have him just not able to fly than it is to give him a fucking jetpack so that he can fly. Lifting throughout Japan Now I'm here and I've gone for a fishing trip in Bailu Shen was dad, where is he? You do not know And I can't find the man who killed father I gotta find out where the guy is, where the other guy, the one guy is. Talk about fish all the time. He gotta know something about the legendary fish, where to go, what to use. A 
was going to take homemade dynamite to pilot snob the blow up fish. Northeast Ohio at its finest and teenagers. Ah. Hence the recognition of the. of that. Right, right, right. Hmm. Five crunches. Crunches? Aren't those like sit ups but shittier and painful? Like, all I know about crunches is they hurt my back against the hard floor because I don't have anything to lay on. And even if I do, I wear jeans, so it still hurts my back. for revered and the kanji for fish. And the kanji for revered is like alcohol over... The hell happened to the water? your fishy butt over here and put you on the table. Shanghua gonna cook me a legendary fish. It's gonna be delish. And she's gonna forget all about the fact that I have not bothered looking for her father. Interesting, interesting. Okay. What it shows as lake is what kanji study has me being taught as pond. Lake? Like, it's... It, it, it's the thing. It's the thing. Lake versus pond. Lake versus pond. Okay. your fishy ass over here. Trying to write some kanji here and you're like, hey, buckaroo. Okay, so you got pond and lake. Now this is what's being translated as lake, which kanji study is like pond to me. But as you know, of course, these are two words mean pretty much the same fucking thing anyway. So <laughs> the differentiation isn't really... <laughs> like, can you tell me the objective difference between a lake and a pond? Now, if we're going to say that a lake 
is, like, huge, like a great lake. Well, then this would clearly be a pond, and the kanji is correct anyway. But, in a local area in America, a piece of water this way, this large, could just be referred to as a lake. It could technically be a pond, but it's just locally called a lake. So, you know, it doesn't really matter. be funny if there was no legendary fish but it was just a story it's like a legend <laughs> like this talk of the legendary fish but it's just that it's just, just talk it's just a legend god damn it god damn it feel like i wasted my time just like all the time i spent all the time i spent playing face off is this what you're gonna say measurement between pond and lake yeah could be some technicalities, I guess. But, like, when it comes to... between the, the different bodies of water, usually people don't really care too much if it's a pond or a lake versus, like, if it's a uh, puddle. Like, they call a puddle a lake. It better be a pretty goddamn big puddle. I'm gonna catch me a fishy fish, and it's gonna be legendary. Today will be the legend of the time the guy from. They'll, they'll be talking about that time that guy from Japan showed up in Bailu Village. He, he got all the legendary fish. He got the legendary fish of legend that no one ever got. He got all the different colored catfish. He got. Got the uh went to the went to the dojo and just double blowed everyone to death. And it's just, just how how it it was then and they learned to fear. They learned to fear the name. Of how's it What's my last name again? I'm halfway through game number three. You'd think I learned this guy's name by now. Hazuki, Hazuki, there we go. <laughs> and that is another lake trout. Nice, nice, nice. I'll pass. Interesting, that is sarcasm. It may surprise you to know that there is no technical difference between lakes and ponds, according to the National Park Service, opens in a new window. However, a general rule of thumb is a body of water just that is large and deep is a lake, you and if it's short and shallow, skill. it's a pond. I just got lucky. Hmm. Okay, let's see if we can find... Find our fisherman friend. You gotta be kicking around somewhere. Fishing, probably. I don't see him down this way. A lot of time he's been hanging around 
the pond past past the uh, sunflower grove. The old fishing hole. If there's anyone in town to ask about the legendary fish, it would be him. He's literally the only guy in town who fishes who will talk to me. I'm not the only one who follows far too closely behind people. It, what, 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 did, what did that? I had a sarcasm. Ah, uh, there he is. There he is. Excuse me. What is it? Legendary fish. Hate to bother you, but it all comes down to fishing. Yes, but legendary fish. What? Anyway, there are lots of people who want to fish. Yeah, like me. Lots of people after the one that got away. Yeah, the legendary one. Right. Hm. Lots of people after the rare ones. Yes. Basically, their lives are defined by fishing. I see. Yeah. You gonna tell me about the legendary fucking fish? Excuse me. What is it? Hate to bother you, but... It all comes down to fish. What? Anyway, lots... Right. Hm. Basically... I see. Well, that's great. There's, there's fucking no one to ask about this fucking fish. Ah. <sighs> Let's see. We got $466. We really didn't make that much. We got more money than we had, but we could still use a lot more. Like, we're broke as shit. I think that lake next to the fishing shop is just not very good. Not very good fishing there. The last time I fished next to the fisherman man, the fish were biting real good. Perhaps he does know the best spots. Perhaps that is the key to great fishing. Just follow the guy who knows what he's doing and do what he does. Take it till you make it. I'm gonna get the legendary fish and people are gonna be like, wow, Rio, how did you do it? And I'll be like, I followed the guy who knew what the heck he was doing. Seemed to work. Hey, Huang, can I, uh, can I rent another tackle? Really go for another tackle. Give me that tackle. Sorry, bud. Rentals are done for the day. You bastard! You've got to come earlier if you want to fish. It's only three. Bam. It's okay. It's a little, almost four, but still. Point stands. Okay, so no more fishing. Still need monies. Oh, one inch punchy up there. Uh, was there any... 
anything but one inch punch in horse stance? Was there? And you, you told me about the, the third one, but I haven't seen it. They got a lot of training stands up here. It's all horse stance. All horse stance. And all one inch punch. Oh, that, uh, the spot for fishing was the one next to Joy Park. And we fished there for part of the little catch the different colored catfish quest. And it was alright. Wasn't... Wasn't amazing. But it, it did the job. Now there's another place to cut wood other than Tau Get. I wonder if they have a... they pay better. This Tau don't pay worth a damn. you like, cut the wood. Uh, I'll give you a nickel. And I did it because I needed that nickel desperately. I wasn't proud of myself. And market, Sunset Hill. Sunset Hill was it? There it is. I hear I can earn some money here. I didn't hear that. I just kind of hey, figured. Hey, young fella, you up to chopping some wood? Yeah, why not? Chopping wood? What did you think you were gonna do here? Sure, I'll help. Now that's what I like to hear. All right, wood chopping time. Just hit it as soon as he puts it up and it goes straight down, but not really. It just, it just doesn't, doesn't, doesn't care. Also, I'm not even getting anything close to a bonus here. Just, just chop it better, chop it better. There we go. We got new music. That's it. That's it. Yes, yes. That's it. Chopping song. That's it. Ah, good night, Cranny. Good night, good night. Okay, so the wage was not really any better over here. <laughs> oh, great job. How about taking another swing at it? I mean, sure, just because I like the music. Okay? And I, I need the money desperately, and I, 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 I have fucking nothing else to do because my sensei is a goddamn lazy, drunken asshole. That's it. There you go. Yes, yes. That's it. Later. That's it. Later, Cronny. Thank you for stopping by. Yes, yes. And my gambling wants to draw a dog it. shit. That is true. That's it. There you go. 
Is gambling the best way? I safe scum the hell out of it, and I just... It takes me... How long did it take me to safe scum up just... That's it. All I had to do was win. Like, once. I wasn't trying to make a certain amount. I just needed to win. And it took... What was it? Over 40 minutes? Of save scumming? One in four chance, they say. There it is. That's it. Yes, yes. That's it. Yes, yes. That's it. There you go. Yes, yes. I like how I started the swinging down huh. animation, but it I did not, not make it. Oh, personality blesser. A quick inquisitor man. Machina, thank you very much for the raid. Thank you, thank you. What a world of difference. You just can't beat youth. I mean, yeah, I mean, pay. absolutely. If you, 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 got a, you got a belt, you absolutely can. But anyway, anyway, uh, inquisitor, inquisitor. What was no, you enjoying? What was I'm you playing? Gonna... That's so. Well, if you change your mind, come on back. You can catch your own wood, sir. Okay, let's see. Oh, yes. I can chop wood. There, there. I can fish there. There's a pawn shop there. Okay. Alright, alright, alright. So let's see. What is going on? What is where? What is who? Who is wit? I need to eat garlic. Just in case someone tries to jump me and beat the shit out of me, it'd be a good idea for me to fill my belly with garlic. Excuse me. Ah, oh. you again. I've got time on my hands. Tell me a story, won't you? Uh, I, I guess. Well, actually. If you got no good ones, let me tell you old stories about the village. Um... <laughs> to just not listen to him. We're listening to him. I'm all ears. A long time ago, this village was robbed by a band of bandits. It's been almost 60, no, 70 years ago. The bandits were here for gold, liquor, and the women. Did you have any of that? When the time came, the men ran away, and those who claimed to be fighters disappeared into thin air. Out of nowhere, a young man shows up to face off against 100 bandits. He took a butcher's knife from one of the bad guys and left a sea of blood in the village square. He went after any fleeing bandits on horseback and took every last one of them down. The peace of the village and the chastity of the women were protected. There shall be no fucking today. That young man. Well, there's no hiding it. It was me. Oh, yeah. <laughs> right. Thanks to that, all the ladies wanted to marry me. It wasn't easy dealing with all those proposals. Well, you seem to have done I've a good job for yourself. A few times, but never took the plunge to get married. You can turn 80, and the only partner you still need is Lee. What happened to the son? My business is doing well, but I've given up on striking it rich. I see. That's all in the past, anyway. Right. Well, that's a way to skip time. <laughs> it's gotten so dark. Maybe I should head back to Shenhua's house. Useful, useful. I had nothing, nothing to do. Okay. Hey, Shenhua, I did a whole lot of nothing today, but I caught a lot of fish. Hey, Shenhua. What's wrong? Mr. Soon told me a little bit about my father. That was the entirety of my Zhao Suming trained with my father. 
Right here in Bailu? Which we already knew. Yeah. And then Soon Ming died under mysterious circumstances. Which we already knew. What? How? Mysterious. That's all I know right now. <laughs> That's awful. Yeah, it's a terribly small amount to get out of an entire Did Mr. day's Soon work. Soon help you out? No. In a manner of speaking. <laughs> no. What's that supposed to mean? Means no. He said he'd teach me his technique. Later. Said being the keyword. <laughs> right. I had to give him some expensive liquor first. Yeah, that was like four days ago. And once I handed that over. Wait, there's more. But he told wait. Me to catch some chicken. There's more. Are you serious? Yeah. Then he'll well, teach first me the he technique. had us kick everyone's ass at the dojo. Well, not everyone. I chose to, to make it a baker's do? dozen. But about what? About Mr. Soon's demands. I'm willing to trust him. Don't! I saw his technique with my own eyes. Doesn't mean he's gonna teach it to he you! He knows what he's doing. Okay. I guess there's nothing to worry oh, about. No! Then. Come on, Shenhua! Please let him Thanks. know he's an idiot! You can't be stupid too! Oh! You don't go back, does she come Naruto running to drag you back home? Uh Hey Shinhua. Hmm? Do you want to keep talking? But I am I'm pretty I, I, it just kinda does the fade to black and you appear at home and it's assumed Ryo just eventually went back on his I've own. I've been meaning to ask. Your clothes. Can you take them off? What about them? The villagers don't wear anything like them. They're unique. In a bad way? I made them myself. No, not in a bad way. In a terrible well, way. that's a relief. Did you really make them? I do everything by myself, as does everyone in the village. That must be tough. Listen, Leo, <laughs> I want to hear more about you. Take off your clothes. Yeah? What's up? What other clothes do you have? Hmm. That's a good question. Well, Leather jacket, school uniform, gym uniform, or ja leather jacket. Leather jacket. All you ever see me in. What school uniform? What gym uniform? We didn't have that section of the game. We didn't even have flashbacks to it. Don't don't get the it, it, it. jacket. I usually just wear this leather jacket. All the time? Do you really like it that much? Yeah. It's the first thing I ever bought with my own money. Oh, wow. So I plan to wear it until it falls apart. Oh. It certainly wow. looks good on you. Yeah, I like how I'm not actually even wearing it right now because just I got the fishy one. Hey, Shinhua. Hmm? Do you want to keep talking? Hey, Shinhua. How can I mail a letter from here? Letters get delivered once a month, so you can mail it then. Once a month? Doing anything by mail must take ages. Who are you planning to send a letter to? Listen, Leo. I want to hear more about you. Yeah? What's up? Do you need to mail a letter? Yeah, that's it. Yeah. What? For, 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 huh? Okay, uh... Okay, to Ine-san, Fuk-san, chen gui -shang, or Tsu yung hong I think Tsu yung hong is the hot martial artist lady. Let me... Let me check real quick. Yes. 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 So we want to mail a letter, a letter to the hot martial artist lady. Ine-san, I'm sure they're fine. Fuk-san, Fukum. And Chen Guishang, uh... I mean, they helped in Shenmue 1, but I haven't thought of them since. Hot martial artist lady? I'm thinking of her a lot. Thinking of her an awful lot. I should write to Xiu Ying. Are you asking me? Hmm? Sorry. I was just thinking out loud. You should write. If no, you not the caretaker. Her. It's more of a student teacher relationship, really. Giggity. All the more reason to write her. Yeah, you're right. She took me in, and saved me several times. And kicked you out of her house. But, but what? 
It's not that we don't get along, but I feel like she'd scold me, no matter what. Wow. I've never heard you sound so scared of someone. I was scare-roused. Hey, Xinhua. Hmm? Do you want to keep talking? When is your birthday, Xinhua? September 9th. Well, that's fast. Oh, okay. Not for a while, then. Why? No reason. Forget I asked. Okay. You're so strange. When is your birthday? Angel B. November the 29th. Okay. We'll have to celebrate. But it's still half a year away. It'll be here before you know it. You old bastard. I guess. A year or even ten can pass in the blink of an eye. You've been talking to that guy in town a lot, I haven't what you? you mean. But that's a bit of an exaggeration, isn't it? You ever been Do in a you coma, really think so? Uh, well... I have these dreams. Really vivid dreams. What happens? I'm in the city where the Emperor once lived. Long ago. My father and mother stand before me. I've only just been born. And they say my name. Your name? Shenhua? Ah, hey, what the fuck? Yes, strange, <laughs> isn't it? What? It feels real, even after I wake up. <laughs> like it happened yesterday. Sometimes, I feel like I've lived through hundreds of birthdays. I feel like I've lived through a hallucination. That's intense. <laughs> Don't worry, it's only a dream. Oh yeah, it's, 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 it's... maybe so. But still. He was probably just nutsos in the buttsos. Hey, Shinhua. <sighs> We've got an early morning ahead of us, Dio. Why don't you head on to bed? better or worse? Thanks. <laughs> I will. Well, Theo, it's time for face-off, so worse. There's a game that's taking Bailu by storm right now. Want to play? Face-off! What kind of game? It's called Face-off. What kind of name is that? Okay, I'll play. Face off. Ready. Set. Rock. Paper. God damn it. <laughs> I win. That was a hideous face, by the way. You always kick my ass at face off. Ouch. So, want to play again? Face off. Ready. Set. I just Scissors. I'm not the only one who noticed. Rock. God damn it. I win. That was a hideous face, by the way. What? I'm not the only one Ouch. who noticed Ryo's so, voice coming out of Shenhua and Shenhua's voice coming out of Ryo for a second there. Face off. Ready. Set. Scissors. Scissors. What the? Hi, Ryo. Shenhua. <laughs> We made the same face. So we did. Okay, here goes. Face off. Ready. Set. Scissors. Paper. Ha! Ha! I won. Your face. <laughs> oh no, I'm not letting you quit while you're ahead. One more game. Face off. Ready. Set. Set. Paper. Paper. Scissors. He's so freaking. I win. That was a hideous face, by the way. What? Ouch. It's getting late. We should stop for today. Wow. Yeah, it is late. We can play again tomorrow. Yeah, we could for play sure. all day tomorrow. As the guy's gonna kick me out first thing in the morning, and then I'm just gonna have nothing but face off to look forward to. But yeah, Whew. it's it is 11 here. We have been streaming for a good four hours. Good four hours. Nice long stream. Uh, but yeah, I gotta get on to my Japanese study. I gotta flip open Genki and and 
keep at it. Oof, it's, it's, it's getting, it's, I'm on the, the new lesson, so of course the new lesson is always hard. Revising all the stuff from the old lessons, that's stuff I've been looking at for the last few months. But the new lesson is just brand new stuff, and it's like, oh god. <laughs> every time, every time this new stuff is just, gotta wrap my head around it. But, thank you all for watching. I've been Decker Shadow. And remember... The legendary fish... may or may not even be real. But that doesn't mean you can't give it a good old college try. And... And let us see about raiding out. Who is a raidable at this very moment? Okay. And the only one, only one currently live is Grandma Loves Games. She's fishing for those diamonds, she says, over in the angler. Spent plenty of time fishing. Plenty of time fishing. I think that's a that's a good good segue. Hop on over to Grandma. Be like, hey, how's it going? Enjoying the time in the angler. And I'll see y'all later.